He's got 99 problems and technology and sleeping is definitely one. guys hope you're all doing well hope you're all looking after yourselves guys welcome back to the shoe dog podcast episode 104 with me and the bro 808 kicks atl please do like follow subscribe come chat to us let's have a conversation let's break it down like we always do please do check out the shoe dog podcast on the audio channels we're on all the audio channels and please do check out the shoe dog podcast on the youtube channels as well and obviously we love the fact that you rock with us and q what we're here to do today bro what are we here to do today, bro? The same thing we do every week, bro. <laughs> Try to take over the world. And today, uh, hence the intro, because it's going to be jokes today. It's going to be a lot of jokes today. It's going to be a lot of uh, words passed back and forth between myself and our esteemed guests. And also TJ and our steam guests. Shots have already <laughs> been fired as soon as the button get pressed. I mean, <laughs> yeah, the sweat's uh, gonna be dripping. Get you in your windows in because this is a podcast that you need to kind of make sure you know all the subliminals that are gonna be shot because guys, so make sure these quotes don't get over your head today, bro. That's what I'm saying. Make nah, sure these nah. quotes don't go over your head today, bro. <laughs> nah, we go, we go, we go end up, we go end up playing the pause game today because we have pause. none other than my personal partner, one of my closest friends, um, been a, a good friend of mine for years at this point. I call him brother. He is a high ranking member of Let's Go Hill. Shout out to Black. He is Mr. 99. He is an athlete. He is a sneakerhead. He is a father. Get your cups and, ready. And, and Paul's, he should have been here a month ago. <laughs> <laughs> it's shot time, man. <laughs> My boy 99. What's cracking, y'all? <laughs> <In the building. laughs> What's good? What's good? Yo, glad to have you, man. Uh, we've been, me and you've been talking behind the scenes for years, just dealing with each other with sneakers. So it was only natural. I I told you I was gonna get you on the pod a long, long time ago. It didn't seem yeah. um really urgent to me because we boys, you know what I'm saying? So I've God, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So already. But for those of y'all that don't know, we're going to keep y'all abreast of the current situation. TJ just had some technology issues when mm-hmm. he cracking jokes. This is what I mean. This, that's what kind of part this is going to be. Mm-hmm. You know exactly. <laughs> yo, yo, 99, you're cursed, bro. 99, you're I cursed. See. That's all I'm I, saying. I, 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 don't broke the, I don't broke it, man. Shit, you know what I mean? You, 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 fall, you fall asleep two weeks ago. You come on a uh, podcast. You destroy all the bloody system. You can't get your iPhone sorted. What the hell, bro? You, what's hey, wrong you, with you today? You couldn't hear the last two, <laughs> two minutes, though, man. True, we had to pause the show. <laughs> you had to reboot. I was co-hosting. I was co-hosting just a minute ago, but it was paused yeah. though. Well, did, did we have a guest today, what? bro? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I think we're sweating already, baby. <laughs> you know go, what? Go, go, I hope go, everybody go. have a great day, a great week, a great month. Great. <laughs> Episode one hundred four, shoot down podcast. Hey, Thank you. See y'all next week. <laughs> Hey Q. We're gonna see y'all next week. Hey Q. That was the show. We just had a great show. Hey Q. Uh, I would call him alternate control delete, man. You gotta reset the whole system. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yo, <Man>. yo. <laughs> Not and I'll call me a control delete. <laughs> a reset. <laughs> okay, okay. Order, 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 order. Okay. So cool. So you are still a guest. So <laughs> I have, I'm, I'm going to go ahead and get these obligatory guest questions out of the way because uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm sick of y'all already. I'm oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, four minutes so, in. <laughs> so you, you played football. 
Yes, sir. Um, pretty high level. When did you start playing football? I mean, recreationally, all all through my life, but organizationally, I didn't start playing until about twenty one, probably. Because you know, be, being from New York, you know, football, you know, it's for fun, but we know we basketball heads, so. That was always my thing, playing ball, hooping. Um, so we were playing rec ball one time, like Thanksgiving or something like that. And it was a bunch of us. And, you know, we, you know how it is on Thanksgiving. Everybody really going at it, you know, blah, blah, blah. So me and my homeboy was like, yo, we look at some leagues. But, you know, we was killing them out there. So when I came across that little semi-pro league, it was a new startup team out in Long Island, which is about – 40 minutes away from where I live in Queens. But I say, hey, I don't have the tools because I never play organized football. So just because I go out here and play rec, don't mean I can play this. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So when I looked into it, it was the new teams. So I said, you can't go wrong with a new team because they ain't got no identity. You know what I mean? They look for players. You know what I'm saying? Right. So so it's going to be people who's probably just as athletic, whatever, as me, that don't know like I do, but hopefully their coaches will do that. So initially... I ran to be a running back, you know, so, but you know, you go to any football trial, no matter what it is, quarterback and running back, everybody wants to be that. So it's like right. six running backs. So, yeah, you know what? It sounds like uh, it, it, everybody in the UK used to want it to be that forward, that striker for, for when, like you guys call soccer, we call football. Yeah, that gotcha. everybody want, either wants, and if nobody wants to be the keeper. Nobody wants to be in goal. No, it's nah, hell like, no. Nah. Nah. <laughs> hey, you, 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 uh, control the score. You know what I mean? They score on you, they can look at you bad. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so yeah, yeah. I, I get that. Yep. I get that. Everybody, but, but the thing is, everybody wants to be in that pressure point. Like you, if you're, if you're a forward or a quarterback or anything like that, you, the pressure's on you. That's, mm -hmm. the, that's the pinnacle point. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So um, when, when, when you started, damn bro, I don't know how I ain't know this about you. I figured you, you played, you know, you went to college and everything like you, you mm -hmm. played football all the way through, but it was, mm -hmm. I didn't think about, is is it? I don't know. No, who who are the like famous football players from New York? It ain't too many of them, right? I mean, there are, but you know, you got guys like Boomer Siasi from Long Island. And you got you got it's it's a trickle effect of guys from New York, but you know how it is now with the basketball circuit. A lot of people, when they can play ball good, they go to different states from when they actually were born, and then you know they they take that state title like oh. He's from, he played his high school ball in Virginia, but they don't know he originally from New York. You know what I'm saying? There, 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 there's, a, there's a lot of players that came from New York, you know, that, that did some things in the NFL. So, What, what, do, you, what do you prefer, uh, American football or the NBA? Basketball. NBA, NBA all day, basketball okay. all day. Because that's, 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 that, that was what I loved. You know, as a kid, because I used to play baseball when I was a kid, and mm. – I was good at it. You know, my grandfather, he loved it. My pops always tell me, to this day, you should never stop playing baseball. But that one summer, my homeboy got a hoop in his backyard, like junior, like middle school. That's a wrap. And, and then, you know, the summer, we all playing ball all day, all night, until his grandmother kicked us out the backyard. And I just <laughs> left baseball alone. And I'm thinking basketball. Granted, I was sh a little bit shorter at that time. But you know, you need my if I can keep about six two, six three, I'd be all right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> so I mean, I didn't have a growth spurt until my junior year. So I went from like five four to like five eleven. You know what I'm saying? And you know, I was I was heavy then. So when I finally grew, you know, my body changed too. So, but I mean, you heavy now? I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, husky. You know, how it is when you, okay. you shop the coast as a kid. I was husky. You know what I'm saying? But I was still athletic and people never understood like how you so athletic. But I was talking about my pops. My pops five foot six, you know. But he was all I was heard stories, he'd be dunking with two hands, this, that, and the third. So I know that's where I got my athletic ability from because my brother, he horrible. And my brother's six three. He the high I wish I could be. You know, I felt sure <laughs> and he 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 trip walking, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> And he's six three, so you know I'm pissed off about that though. So, but yeah, but basketball's always, but basketball's always been my passion. But when I started playing football, I took that serious. So you know, yeah. but like I told y'all, when I started, I wanted to be a running back. And then one day, while I was waiting 
and the defense that had nobody on the other side. So the coach was like, hey, play DN for a little bit. So I learned how to do that, the technique. I didn't have it right, but my athleticism made up for that. And, you know, as I worked on the craft, I got better and better and better. And I couldn't be stopped off that edge. Like, me and my boy, was, they called us problems. So this, they couldn't stop us coming off that edge. You know what I'm saying? Like, I will get there so fast, the quarterback didn't even get the ball off to the running back yet. And I take the hand off. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I didn't know what I was doing. You know, like I said, I'm just, just, just using raw technique. You know what I mean? So, just get but, there. yeah, exactly. So, you know. But playing football hurt my basketball a little bit because I had to gain weight to play that position. You yeah, know I was, I was gonna, I was gonna say that because you, you've done, you've done baseball, basketball, and American football. Um, yeah. I'm gonna call it American football just for the UK audience yeah, yeah. and you. And I your got audience. you. But, but ba- so basically, um, do you, like we we talk about Michael Jordan going into his like whole uh, basket NBA career, then he's going into his baseball career. What, what kind of differences did you find in in that whole t- in that whole realm? Because I know for a fact that that that, that each sport is dedicated to different uh, muscle groups. So obviously, if you yeah. play basketball, it's going to be different to baseball because you need but different strength areas in different regions. But we saw we definitely saw Michael Jordan kind of evolve into a baseball player over mm-hmm. the, over the time scales that he did. he's getting. He was getting better and better and better because his technique was advancing. He was learning more, and that, that's what you need to do when you're an athlete. But how did you find it? Well, like when I was start, well, I was playing basketball. So, like I said, once I had that growth spurt, so I probably was about six foot one ninety at the time. So, mm-hmm. me, you know, I was flying all over the court. They used to call me Air Strong, shit like that, stuff like that. Yeah, and Air uh, Strong. <laughs> so, so, so football wise, when I when I switched to go play defense. I think I started working out more because I wasn't working out there, you know. You know, when you're young, you just run up and down, wake up, eat whatever you want to eat, blah, blah, blah. So when I started going to the gym and I know I was playing defense, I probably got to about 220. You know what I'm saying? Then after that, like my next year, I was just going hard in the gym and I probably got to about 240. You know what I'm saying? So Mm. the football was perfect, but the basketball, I mean, basketball is still kind of the same, but I can see the difference. You know what I'm saying? Like, I went from more of a finesse game to a power game, as you can yeah. see, Q, when I went out there on Sunday nah, nah, and stuff was, like that. I was going to bring that up because uh, <laughs> it's the let's, let's go here. Uh, they do basketball on Sundays at um, Gresham Park in the summertime. And um, bro be out there like like uh, a bowling ball, pretty much. <laughs> like you can't you can't touch him dog. <laughs> if you touch him you gonna hurt yourself whether you got the ball or he got the ball uh, he ain't got to have the ball and you ain't got to have the ball bro you don't want listen if i was playing basketball if i'm picking my team i need bro on my because he moves like what you you like 240 250 right now right now no i like 270. oh guys he that's don't that's he hard. don't move like it bro he don't move like it at all. He moves so quick on the basketball court. And like he's saying, he grew up hooping. So, you know, once you get older, athletically, you might not be able to do the same thing. But mentally, you so far yeah. advanced. You know what I'm saying? Especially when we're talking amateur. Come on, mm-hmm. the man, The man's out there going crazy on folks, bro. I, I was feeling, because they kept getting mad. They told him he was playing football. And he was. <laughs> He was playing football on the basketball court. <laughs> but, but it was legal. It's legal. It's like playing with Shaq. You know what I'm saying? When you weigh more than everybody else, it's going to look worse than it really is. You know what I'm saying? Because they you doing real basketball stuff is just more powerful than everybody else can do it. You know what I mean? It's yeah. ridiculous, bro. I, I was I was surprised to see how quick you, you move. You know what I'm saying? So I can see how, how that was a problem playing organized ball. Like, oh, yeah, for sure. Who who want to guard this guy? <laughs> so 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 night so ninety nine so ninety nine so nine was playing basketball on the court. <laughs> yeah, basketball. <laughs> <laughs> basketball. <laughs> Bruh. Nah, nah. Is is the skill the skill uh, that you put on display was impressive though that that day. I th- I got footage of that actually, but we're gonna leave that we're gonna leave that alone. <laughs> uh, so. Being that you're from New York, I I got two questions. Shoot. The Louis Thames. We didn't talk about the Louis Thames. Mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What what's your feelings on the on the Louis Thames? Man, listen, if it ain't the originals, man, we don't we don't classify that. 
with us like that, man. You gotta have okay. the regular construct. What do you, you think about the Supreme? If you choose, would you choose the Supremes or the Louis? I really want either one of them, but I probably would go. I probably would go with Louis over okay. Supreme one. Louis over Supreme? I thought it would be the other way around. Cause, Cause like, Supreme. you know Supreme, Supreme, you 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 generate that towards sneakers. You know what I'm saying? Can I say something? I, I, you know, the only reason why I like that Supreme collaboration is the is the greater effect on that sneaker. The fact that they put the embossed grating, <laughs> like steel grate, on that sneaker, that looks dope. Like it, it yeah. brings more of the urban flair onto that sneaker. The Louis, the Louis is like a luxury sneaker. Like you, you can flex it, and if you knew, if people know what it is, you know what it is. But I think I gravitate to the Supreme <laughs> one because it gives me more of that urban street feel to that sneaker because of that great uh, effect on that sneaker but like like you said it get the louis one's more of a luxury so yeah. in my mind if you're going to do that you go get the louis to match it like that head to toe because i'm a matcher you know what i'm saying yeah so yeah but you you, but you can coordinate you... those and you'd be like oh that that he did it right i don't like the boost but he did it right you know what i'm saying yeah, nice. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I do agree. Like, but Pharrell killed it. Like, in, in terms of Louis, Pharrell killed it. But I, I can see more Louis coming on, which are going to be way more better than what, what he's released in terms of the print being more predominant. And bro, mm-hmm. those, those are. I think they might auction those. I'm not even joking. With, with, with what they did with the Air Force ones, they might auction that in terms of uh, yeah. other bees. Um, but uh, and especially, especially if like Timberland end up doing, I mean, and Timberland have got enough white as well. Especially if you kind of do a triple collaboration with that that would be crazy mm-hmm. uh True. but you you want you want we, that so bad no, I don't want that so bad. I, i'm i'm just i'm just giving brands ideas but um uh, no, 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 in, ter- no, in terms no, no, no. No, I, got, I, got, I got an idea for you i got an idea for you, okay i tell i tell you what you need do what you need right here since you got all these ideas we're gonna, get you, we're gonna get you a pair of these American flag teams. Nah, I can't do that, man. Nah, <laughs> nah, man. nah, 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 nah. nah. I, bro, I, I've got an even better. You know what? I've got an even better one. I would, I would like that Timberland all butters, all, all weak butter, with the top tab with a British flag, bro. That would be dope, bro. That would be dope. Guess what? You're don't, a customizer. Don't say it. Don't say yes. it. Don't say yes. it. Don't yeah. say it. <laughs> I love, you, you, you can make I love that when you set yourself up like that. <laughs> you can make that happen. It's all, it's all, it's all, it, no, no, no. It's all about, about time and space. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Time and space. But sure. I, I'm going to add to Q's question because you're from New York, right? Mm-hmm. Now, the, the main question is, the main question is, Air Force Ones mm. or Timberlands? That's the main question. <sighs> I'm going to say... He's think. I'm gonna say the Air Force Ones. Ooh. Mm. <laughs> Why? Well, you know, we don't call them Air Force Ones in New York, so we call them Uptowns. Uptowns, yeah. right, cool. A lot of people, I mean, now they got so many different varieties of it. You might see that a lot more, even though we're a cold state and it snows a lot. But, I mean, I've seen dudes wear Timberlands in the summertime playing ball. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, but mm-hmm. I'm still going Air Force Ones because they're a little bit Did- cheaper and people always get two or three pairs of the white ones alone and they might have a pair of the black ones in the stash at night. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? All so. Right. All right. All right. Now, 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 um, now this is where I'm going to make you sweat a bit. What Air Force mentality or activity have you ever done that you can divulge in the podcast? Say that again. <laughs> what, <laughs> Air Force, <laughs> what Air Force mentality have you participated in that you would like to divulge in a podcast, which probably don't make it illegal, but you can, which you can divulge in a podcast? No, he's trying to get you to incriminate yourself. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> don't do it, bro. Oh man! <laughs> don't do it, bro. Don't do it. No, 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 no. no. We will not yeah. have any discussion. Yeah, I can't say that. Uh, bro, bro, man, I'm, I'm, I'm about to plead the fifth on that one. I'm about to plead the fifth, man. I don't know who watching or who hate me. They're gonna use that against you, man. 
I might go to work on I might go to work on Monday, but hey, can you step into the office real quick? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. You, you you might step into the office and uh, he says, okay, uh, you know what? I'm not I'm not gonna get rid of you. I need you to do me a favor. You know those guys here for someone wear them and do this activity for me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the enforcer. <laughs> hey. hey. That's a good point. That's a good point. Hey, we, hey, yeah. we know. We know what we work at. Not me and yeah, that man. Exactly. We, you know. We know what we work at. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, don't never self. No, never self snitch on yourself. That's what I'm saying. Never. Or so, anybody else. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. when you when you hooped, what was your sneaker of choice? Mm. Uh, we know. We know it was. You know, a different time. We know the tech wasn't this this new. Some of it's trash. Some of it's cool, but we knew we knew what we had back then between the different brands. Everybody had their signature tech. Yeah. So like, what was your your favorite, or even like just the one you hooped in the most? I guess that you that you felt the most comfortable with back then. Well, you know me, Q. Uh, <laughs> you know I always try to look good even when I was hooping. So. But I always had like my 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 pops was always the type like he'll buy me a shooter chilling and buy me stickers to balling. You know, balling stickers only touch the court. So it did it, it, it really matters. If it was a new Jordan out and it was that time of the year, I, I was hooping in that. You know what I'm saying? Because that's that's how it was for me. You know what I'm saying? And like my favorite hoop shoe were the elevens. Mm. I don't know if it's because of the look, but I ain't comfortable on my feet. I know a lot of people have Disagreements yeah, with the, that. The, 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 11s are comfortable. Yeah, I and, love anything, and, and anything above, like, um, I would say anything above, no, normally, all of them are quite comfortable. Like, I don't yeah, know, it zone, depends on your... Yeah, yeah, that's what we're yeah, talking about. Exactly. Like, it depends on how your foot's laid, if it's widespread or stuff like that, but everybody mm-hmm. has different foot. And, like, when people suggest, give you suggestions to say, oh, uh, is it true to size? Yo, it's true to size for me, but I don't know, for you, you got to go and test that because I don't know how your foot lay. Um, yep. But, yeah, but for, for, for sure, though, like, you just, I think 11s, 11, 12s and 13s are comfortable. I don't know why people don't find them comfortable, but it all depends on how your foot lays anyway, so. Yeah, exactly. Even the 14s are comfortable to hoop in. They may not look it, but they were comfortable. I had some of my best games in those things, you know. <laughs> but um. So, what about uh, football? Football, when it came to cleats, um, I always tried to get the Jordan cleats, but they were hard to get because they don't drop them out like that. And then football. You're dropping a lot now, bro. Now nah, they are, and I'm not playing. Like that, you know. Do, 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 bro, do you, they just dropped the uh the eleven gratitude cleats, bro. I seen them yesterday, uh, yeah, a couple days ago. I no, said I'm not don't. gonna send this to bro because he's gonna get mad. <laughs> I might play just. I <laughs> might get him and just stop playing again. <laughs> do, 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 do you wish? Do you wish you could? Uh, do you feel like you would have been done better with what with the technology now than you did in the past? Like, do you wish you were playing now rather than than, than the past? Uh no, nah, I think it's about the same. I, okay. I, I'm not, oh, let's say this shoe gives you better, your game gonna be better than this shoe, that shoe, this, that, and third. That's like how people say, oh, because everybody wearing low tops, they sprain their ankles. I mean, dude, when we was wearing mids and, and high tops back in the day, we still spraining our ankles. You know, yeah. I, I, I kind of like the new tech, to be honest with you, I kind of like the new tech now because a lot of things are lighter, you know. Yeah. The lighter the shoe, sometimes you feel like you might do better because, you know, you run a little bit faster, you jump a little higher, you know what I'm saying? It's just like, so like LeBron James, his sneakers are not basketball sneakers to me. I don't know how he do it, cause his things are like heavy. Yo, bro, but but bro, bro, but you know what? Like you're you're right there. You're hundred percent right there. If you got if you wear LeBrons, you know exactly what Nine Nine saying because like the some of the LeBrons, the unit air unit on the LeBrons is high. Like I, yep. if I put if I, if some sneakers, if I put my feet in them, I feel like I'm I'm on stilts. Like it's the the balance on the actual bubble is a bit like, and I'm not heavy. I'm 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 like two twenty, right? I'm not heavy. Uh, for for my size, but so I feel like I haven't got enough pressure on my on my on, on my weight to actually push mm-hmm. the bubble down to be stable. But LeBron's bigger than me; he's heavier than me, and he kind of gets that. So and even even like even Zion sneakers, you, you, Zion sneakers will feel odd to people because he's a yeah. bigger guy. And you got to remember that. You got to remember that not every sneaker suited to p- different people. Well, and you know they, their sneakers are different than ours. They got the special yeah. mid soles exactly. and arches yeah, and stuff yeah. in it. 
But like LeBron, the first LeBron's best sneakers. I one of the best sneakers I ever played in. His first, his mm-hmm. first ones. They nice Zoom and light. Generation. Yeah, Zoom generation. Nice and light. It's cut right. A lot of his sneakers to me are cut funny in certain places where it's uncomfortable, like around the ankle mm-hmm. area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, they look yeah. good though. He got the colors. He got the little segways. You know, he he does his thing on that part. But... And, and didn't 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 LeBron bowl in uh, Air Forces uh, back in the day? Or well, once once or twice? I don't know. I I, I remember. He that, I think he some custom young. ones. He was yeah. playing Adidas in high school though. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. But they dropped it. Um, they had the Air Forces for uh, for his uh, when we first came out, but uh, uh, his school, the high school joint. Yeah. yeah, he done had a bunch of forces, bro. Like the bro. Yeah. and they all been lows, if I'm not mistaken. Even Every time mm-hmm. he dropped uh, uh, Air Force, it's a low. Yep. Even the gen, even even that generation Zoom, it feels like a, a big unit sneaker, doesn't it? Like it feels it more almost gives you that Air Force uh, energy on that sneaker. They do, especially when he came out with the all wheat ones, like Tim's. <laughs> bro, that was dope. That was dope. That was so dope. I know. <laughs> <laughs> but so so you're basically saying. It's talent over technology. Yeah. Oh, okay. Right. Sure, you got you got Julius Randle right now playing in freaking sketches. He having the best season he has in years. <laughs> what, what, Snoop, what, what Snoop sketches, yeah? Snoop sketches, yeah? Yeah, something like that. No, no, no. No, no, no. no, no, no. no we got no. basketball joints. Yes. So, they got the so basketball look, joints. Snoop, Snoop getting his own collab with sketches. I know. I know. Yeah, this I, is true. I, yeah, this stuff. It's it's not as trash as Julius Randle sketches are, but it's still trash. Yeah. Uh, but well, so, you you said it before, but Snoop's making his money. Let him make his money, bro. Bro, Snoop gonna get all the money except yeah, he... from OnlyFans. You, you know, you know, <laughs> you know, you know what, But but you know what the funny thing is, bro? Right? That you know that whole quite campaign about Snoop, like with that smoke campaign, and it wasn't him quitting um, smoking. It was for a furnace, like a, a smoking yeah. furnace. Yeah. Bro. I, I the, the the whole funny thing with, with that situation was he got his money and the they company didn't yeah no. <laughs> damn yeah. Business, yeah 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 bro that's crazy right. Snoop got that bread though <laughs> shout yeah. out Snoop <laughs> hey give me mine first <laughs> right, right, right. I want mine up front <laughs> that, one, that, one, that, that, commer- one. that commercial were running they ran that commercial to the ground bro Word. I, see, I saw it every day it was on YouTube videos it was popping up on websites they they, they spent the ad money so yeah mm-hmm. give me mine and y'all do what y'all do what they thought I don't know why they thought that was gonna work oh hey I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. It, they tried, they tried it. Look, but bro, you, you can only try and fail, and basically, I hope they kind of bring themselves back up and start, um, what well, come, come become famous. Well, not famous, but more, um, uh, a bit like in their business sense, they become popular again. Bro, but the egg, yeah, it's, the, it's, egg, it's, the egg grills ain't even hire celebrities. They're like they were like one of the biggest, uh, companies that produce like grills and smokers and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Those type of companies don't need to have no big celebrity commercial ads nope you know I mean? it's it sell itself it is it is what it is gone gone bro next question um what's the what's the give me your top three all time top three favorite sneakers mm. first i'm gonna go with my phone posits the penny ones the original I knew you blue was a f- phone guy black and blue oh. phones coming they coming back this year in a, in a real way too so yeah, you yeah. already got the pennies. Uh, <laughs> uh, did you okay. did you manage to get the eggplants? Or oh, is it is, is uh, the galaxy is supposed to be coming out this year? Eggplants came out a couple of weeks ago. They no, came out yet here. Nah. Oh, yeah. Okay, cool. No, okay, maybe they're not come out. I, I'm I'm kind of getting mistaken here, but the eggplants are coming out. I think the galaxies are supposed to come out. The mm-hmm. Katie galaxies are coming out as well. I I saw this trend coming because obviously they did release the Big Bangs, which is a part of the galaxy, if it, uh, like kind of uh, range as well. Because when you look at the Big Bang Lebrons, they've got the galaxy vibe in, ter- yep. in terms of sneaker. So I saw that coming, and, and I know the galaxy sneakers are coming back. So it's gonna be quite interesting to see what happens with those. Yeah. Yeah. Number two. Well. That- so the pennies is your one? Yeah, because, yeah. Because in, 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 in when those hit, those things dropped was in 98? No, 96, when, um when uh, what's his name, Miles Simon, had, not Miles Simon and Mike Bibby won him in the, te- in the championship. Right, 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 right. NCAA right, right. joint. And I saw those, and me and my pops was like, hey, what are those? And then when those things dropped, I dropped the ball when they dropped, though. Because he gave me an option. 
Do you want these or you want the King Griffey's? Uh, Griffey's, Griffey, we man. <laughs> and, 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 look, that's why I said I dropped the ball. I, I got the Griffey's. You know what I'm saying? Because I saw this, I saw this ill uh, tracksuit that went with the Griffey's. So I said, let me get the Griffey's. So I chose the Griffey's because I saw the tracksuit that went with it. But yeah. I'll end up, I'll later on, I end up getting them anyway. So, oh, yeah, yeah. So, so it was, the, that, that, that was the a... one. The ones you got. Hold on, real right quick. The ones you got. Them, they make the OGs. Is it? With the pennies? Yeah, the yeah. ones you got right there. That's the original OGs. From 96. Oh, hell no. Nah. I, I mean, say, that it's, the one that, it's the one that dropped, but, it's, you know. It's the re-retro. It's yeah, re-retro, re retro. retro. Yeah, yeah. No, I, 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 no, I thought you was pulling up an OG, OG pair, because I'm like, bro, that look like you ain't even hardly warm. Since uh, then, like, they, they, they in great shape. <laughs> you know me, bro. You know me, man. <laughs> Yeah, so what, yeah. What's, what's I know your you and TJ, you and TJ got this this uh dead stock disease, but we gonna we gonna get that. <laughs> what you mean dead stock disease? Don't worry about it. What's the next? The next next? What's your next favorite sneaker, bro? Uh, the Elevens, the Concords. Ooh, or Elevens. You can't. Yeah. I mean, you know me. I like I like I like a flashy shiny shoe, and that shoe is so like, I hate said luxury looking. Like you can wear those yeah. anywhere. Yeah. Anywhere, yeah, yeah. Very you could, you could, you, you, you could rock that back in when the Hall of Night days. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> you know yeah. what I'm saying? Bro. Yeah, that was that was that was the inspiration. That was what exactly designed them to look like. So, yep. Yeah, yep. yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So, what's your third one, bro? The Air Max '97 Dan O'Brien Olympic joints, silver bullets. Hmm. That the the dope. The dope. Why the silver, the not the gold first... or, the, or the bronze? Huh? Why the silver? Why the silver, not the gold or the bronze? Because at that time it was just really the silver, but okay, you never really seen an all silver shoe looking like that. Mm -hmm. And that mm -hmm. bubble, you know, that bubble caught you. Yeah. You know, that big bubble all the way around the shoe. I mean, we've seen bubbles big, but it been sectioned off a little bit. But when those came out, and I saw those, the I'm not the most. I'm not like going to tell you how I got those my first pair, bro. <laughs> yeah, he had on Black Forces when he, when he got the silver. Nah, shoes. nah. <laughs> hey, hey, I might have. Because, hey, what I did, right? So it was like 4th of July. And and it was, it probably it came out. So my pops bought me a whole bunch of fireworks. So, you know, I popped the fireworks. So the kids on the block ain't had no fireworks. So I'm selling them at a high price. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I got enough for myself and I got enough to sell the rest of these kids. Bro, I came up like, my pops paid like 180 for almost everything. I made like almost 200 just selling it to the kids, bro. I had, their bro I had their parents, bro, I had their parents coming to me like, hey, my son has $75. He ain't got nothing left because he's buying five or few. I'm like, hey, that's not my problem. <laughs> Cause I know where I'm going in the morning. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy, bro. Reselling fireworks to buy some sneakers is <laughs> because that, it's bro. illegal. It's, it's illegal in New York, really. So you really couldn't get them from anywhere. So my oh, pop had to go to. He had to drive a, a, like an hour and a half away in Pennsylvania to get them to bring them back. You know what I'm saying? Like some of our bodegas, they 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 you know they do the same thing and they'll sell it out the store. But you know, at a certain time of night, you ain't gonna be able to get that from them because either they already sold out or they don't close for the day. So I, I'm the only one on the block, and the people down the block they got you know fireworks and stuff. So these kids want to buy it. I'm gonna sell it to you. Mm. Wow. Well, it, it, it was supply and demand, bro. Supply and demand. There you if go. There's, if there's if there's no supply, there's big demand. You know, you're in exactly. the block. That's all I'm saying. Um, <laughs> all right. What what is the worst free sneakers you ever owned in your mm. rotation? Worst free. Yeah. Worst My free, bro. My girl had bought me no, no. right there. <laughs> go, go, go. I'm gonna say I'ma say they free. I ain't it, it might as well have been free. Them damn Stefan Marbury strawberry joints. <laughs> 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 I opened up I said, what the heck? Nah, nah, we ain't doing this. <laughs> <laughs> Not the strawberries. The strawberries, bro. I was like, oh hell no. Nah. <laughs> oh, hell 
no, indeed, hell no, bro. Not the strawberries. We, we, I mean, we answer, the other answer your question, like other free, like when I used to get free shoes for hooping and stuff like that, it was always top shelf shoes. So it was never yeah. no trash and that like that, you know. So, uh, so, so what, what three, what like so, so, except for the strawberries, what, what's um two other sneakers that you really don't like? Hmm. All right, Air Force Ones. You don't like Air Force Ones? Mm -mm. Really? Mm -mm. Never been okay. a fan like that. Never been a fan like that. Only uh, ones I had, only ones we had, I had, is what we talked about when LeBron dropped those St. Mary's and Vincent joints. And I knew because it was, yeah. you know, you know, you get that, you get the jersey at the time. Rocking a jersey was cool. You know right. what I'm saying? So it's those. And my other ones are. The change the strap nikes. Uh, Remember they had the, the up tempos and you could change the, the colors on the straps. Okay, yeah. And it looked like this. It like it like a, it like a uh, they might burn them back out now, but you could it change yeah. like a dog muzzle. Yeah, the, when you the, uh, the, the, era, the era just force. Yes. Uh, yeah. Ambush, ambush just uh did. Yep. I think ambush did four colorways, four mm -hmm. or six colorways. I think it's like then, yeah. Um, Nike dropped two OG colorways, the white and the black. The yeah. problem, so, see, so, I loved, I loved the Air Just Force back in the day because you could actually buy the different color straps. Now, yeah, they not selling the straps, mm -hmm. so I don't see the point in selling the shoe if you're not gonna sell the different color straps. Because I'm not trying to buy two shoes to be able to swap the strap. Yeah, yeah. It, it also reminds me of the remember the about a couple of years back we had that Jordan one with the zipper that you can actually unzip the top to make turn yeah, it into yeah, a, like yeah. a low. Yeah, it reminds me of what that. Like if you, I don't know, bro, it just the Westbrook. It kind of no. Oh, the one Westbrook used to wear. No, nah, no, it no, was no. a it, Jordan one where and it was the, like the top, the top oh, panel and the bottom panel separate. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Yeah, that was that was that was odd. That was odd. That's just like the stash, the stash Jordan one, that's gonna disappear too. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just yeah. like the React um, Jordan one disappeared. Hundred percent. Like it's 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 kind of when the brand's kind of like trying to get something to make something different, like ha having a conversion sneaker, we can go from a mid to a low to a high. Sometimes it doesn't catch on, and this is what we saw with that. And this is like with the up tempo chain strap one, it kind of reminds me of that sneaker. No, it's, it's the air just, bro. I like the air just. just. I just feel like when they brought it back, they should have gave us just give us give us an extra strap or two in the package. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah, make it make it interesting. Like especially with with ambush when they dropped the first two colorways, they did an all blue one and an all orange one. And they sat, bro. Like people wasn't interested because it's like. But the, I but the thing about it, Q, hooping wise, I'm saying it's not good though, because of the strap thing. Because it goes to the bottom too. You know what I'm saying? Right. So you're you're conscious of that. So you might as well just take the damn strap off and keep moving. No, you know yeah, I mean? for hooping for hooping purposes, definitely I understand not having the strap. I'm talking yeah. about for fashion. I wouldn't wear mm -hmm. that to hoop. No way. You know what I'm saying? If if it was me, it would be Jordan's. Like. I mean, a lot of the Nike stuff, we know how dope the Nike stuff was, but yeah. if, it, if it wasn't a Penny or a Barkley, it, it'll be Jordan's as far as basketball. With, oh, yeah. With, uh, but, I forgot what, but I forgot what player it was for at that time. I don't, so, I don't, somebody I don't marketed think, it. I don't know who, who, who name they put on it. I'm, but it they put a name on it, but you know how it was back in the day. They ain't put a name on it, but that person had a poster with it. Oh, that's the new Allen Houston song. Yeah, blah, yeah, blah, yeah, blah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, eight more, eight, eight people. It might have been him because like eight more other people had it. You know what I'm saying? But and in they different were doing states. The school colors too. I, I, yeah, I, I can see. I can see that page in East Bay right now where they show East the Bay and all yep. the different color straps that you can buy with it. They have that orange, was, that, blue, green, purple, red, every color you can imagine of the strap. You and that's why that was the basketball shoe for high school. Right. High school and college that year, yep. Because mm -hmm. of the colors. What? Uh, so, what silhouette do you believe that Nike have basically gotten this in the archives that they should re-release? That's both. The question to both of you guys: What do you think they should release? Because, like, we're talking about really old, like sneakers that the, te the text not there, the, 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 the accessories are not there. What sneakers would you want to see come back? 
that's easy for me. You know, it's well, I could easily say, uh, you know, I want the diamond turfs. Uh, mm. The diamond yeah, turf one. Um, yeah, we should. Hopefully, we'll get the ones yeah. back. But uh, yeah, yeah. I want the the OG Air Max ninety six. Mm. Not the not the Air Max ninety six two. The OG Air Max, the one that Supreme did a couple years ago with the clear um, okay. the clear mm. panels on it. That one and with the OG colorways. For me, yeah. I want I want them to bring back the Nike Pump. People didn't really see it like that when it came out. In the late eighties, a lot of somebody, people didn't know about that. Somebody was somebody just brought that up to me the other day, bro. I know I brought it up to you a few times, but like, yeah, because they had it on um one of those on the site for like six hundred. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, the David Robinson one, ones. But I'm talking David about the, the other ones, yep, like the Billy Ho ones or the David Robinson the one, one where you actually pump it up in your back, pump it up, yeah, yeah. You t- you mm-hmm. take, was it the, take take the insole out and start pumping it up and all of that stuff? No, 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 no. It was no, no. Uh, uh, a pump pump, uh, like a, a pressure gun back. type thing. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, they had. Okay. It was a valve, like in the in the very top of. Oh, the, the big the big fat valve in the back. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. yeah. yeah. That was dope. That's dope. Right, Kidoki. Um, let's. Shall we go? Shall we do some serious sweating now today, bro? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> And 99, if, if, if you watch this, I feel sorry for you. Um, lose, He's choose, smiling. or dump. I think he knows. <laughs> he knows. Lose, choose, or dump. Well, basically, I'm going to give you three options. You're going to either lose it, choose it, or dump it. It means if you lose it, you mean you lose it for yourself and give it to everybody else. If you choose it, everybody gets it. And if you dump it, it disappears for everybody. It doesn't even exist in history. So, lose, choose, or dump. Are you choosing OG, GR, or collaborations? I'm gonna so, choose OG. Damn, he's fast. Right, I was about good, to get ready. Yeah. <laughs> I was about to get ready to explain. All right, so you're 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 you're, cho- you're, cho- you're choosing you're choosing OGs. What you're losing and what you're dumping. So whatever you lose, everybody else you don't can, get. can get, and whatever you dump, nobody has ever. So right. it's GRs, which is just you know regular colorways, regular, like we all yeah. get you know gratitudes, uh, yeah, yeah shot bat boards and yeah <laughs> and stuff like that, or collabs, which is the Alma Mayers, the Travis Scotts, the Off Whites, stuff like that. Um, GR, so I'll I'll lose it. Oh, you got, so you're, du- you're dumping collaborations. Then. Yeah, I do. I'm dumping hey. collabs. Hey, I, I like that. A lot of people say that. A lot of people say that. A lot of people yeah. say that. Because those cool. are the hardest to get. You know what I'm saying? And then they resell them for triple the damn price. Facts. Yeah, yeah. And you hardly it's, see it's, them. It, yeah, it's kind of off-putting sometimes. All right, cool. Round two. <laughs> Loose shoes or dump? Penny foam posits, mm-hmm. Concord 11s, or mm-hmm. Air Max 97 silver bullet, mm-hmm. bro. What are you losing? What are you choosing? And what are you dumping, bro? I'm sorry, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going a, I'm to a, I'm a choose the, the Concords. Okay. Mm-hmm. I'm going okay. to lose the, the penny foam posits. I, I want everybody else to have them. And and because and, right, and, yeah, yeah. a lot of people see the price tag and don't want to buy them, but don't know how comfortable those shoes really are. And I'll dump I'll dump the ninety seven. Okay, okay, I I respect that. I respect that. And yeah, and you know um, I think I think that's a I think that's your current logic. Yo, a younger you probably would have moved a little different on that one, because you don't wear that many Air Max now. Ah. Uh, I mean, I got like four of the new ones, 97s, you know. I'll never see you wearing them like that, though. Bro, I got too many damn shoes, bro. I don't see you wearing all y'all. <laughs> 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 right, you, you, you know what? You, you know what? You know what? No, no, no. Because we, we, we t- today is Super Bowl Sunday. Uh, yeah, yeah. And we're going to party. We got a Super Bowl party we're going to meet up at. You gonna, I'm going to show you some. I'm gonna show you. So it's um, raining too. It's raining too. So I still gotta be kind of picky. But I, yeah, I'm gonna show you some. Well, I got you. Dude. I got nah, you too. No, nah, no, nah, y'all, y'all, y'all be trying to act like y'all ain't got the DS disease, bro. 
Y'all do. <laughs> Both of y'all. Uh, y'all got, uh, y'all got DS Nick. You know what's going to happen? Y'all going to be them guys. And I'm not wishing this on y'all. So don't take this to heart when I say it. But y'all could possibly end up being them guys uh, like old boy recently pulling out that brand new sneaker, uh, yeah. white cement fours and they already falling apart in the box before you even touch them. You know what I'm saying? Y'all got hey. DS disease, bro. Bring them sneakers outside, bro. Let them breathe. Are they uh, breathing all right? But, 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 but by the way, by the way, guys, if you want, if you don't want your sneakers to fall apart, go and check out my YouTube video where I actually describe and tell you how to maintain your sneakers for the longevity. Because at the end of the day, it's the moisture in your room and it's the moisture and atmospheric moisture that gets to your sneakers that do great your sneakers. So go and check out check out that video yep. if you want to preserve your sneakers. But um, you thought it was all over, but it's not, bro. Ah oh, shit! Here we go again. <laughs> right. So. Super Bowl, you're, you're, you're in the Super Bowl final, right, tonight. Last down, third down, three seconds on the clock. What's on your feet? The Stefan Stolbrys, the Air Force Ones, or the, or the Air Just? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to Air Just. I'm going to Air Just, man. I'm going to Air Just, man. I'm going to Air Just, man. Hey, but what choice? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. I had to do it. I had yeah. to do it. I had to do it. No, 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 no. Hey, plus, plus, plus. This, this is, this is. It has to be around the time when that shoe actually came out, when they were still playing on turf, turf. Because boy, you trying to wear in one of them. Uh, yeah. Uh, not, not, not so much the, the, the second choice, but. Yeah, bro. Air just on on field turf, and make sure you got your uh <laughs> your elbow tape on. Too. <laughs> make sure you got your elbow yeah, tape. I, I, yeah, I can't see you putting no cleats on no strawberries. No. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, how nasty would that be? You know I can do that now. Yeah. Yeah, I see it done before. <laughs> do, do, do you feel do you feel your uh, uh, habits, sneaker habits, buying habits have changed as you've gone older? And that, that's a that's a really secret, like really dark question for a lot of people because I think my my um, buying habits have changed over time uh, since I first started collecting. But has yours? Yes, it, it has because I used to get sneakers every week, just about. But the reason why I don't because my daughter's a sneakerhead. So now if I get some, she got to get some like every oh. day. She's 16, <laughs> but it started long before she was 16. Every day, she texts me a new sneaker that she wants. I'm like, bro, Chris is past the red. She's like, yeah, I know. But anyway, you know, so, you know, she does track and she does softball. So I get shoes uh, for that and that. And, you know, so. And you know what happened when, when he get them text messages? I started yep. getting text messages. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Q. Let, <laughs> let, no, you know no, what? You no. know what? He, 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 he picks up the phone and he goes to his daughter, let me talk to my plug. Let me talk to my sneaker yep. guy. I might be able to get you a sneaker, but it might be a 50-50 chance, but let me talk to Q. <laughs> hey, you she she what, might. You know she going to start asking for his number now. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> She knows. She knows who I am. He made sure know. She, she knows. <laughs> he he exactly. be getting on about it too. It'd be funny. Yeah. But since 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 TJ uh, asked you that question, we got another question. This is the patented shoe dog hypo scale meter list of tiers. Mm -hmm. As you can see, we tier zero through four, from super limited to casual. So on this scale, where do you think you land as far as your buying uh, habits right now? Right now? Yeah. Probably three. Tier three. Okay. Yeah. Nine OG, new retro. Yeah, because you know all the new colorways that come out now. You know me, Q. You know I'm a color guy, so... Every time yeah, I see something with a different yeah. a different flavor, you know, I got to have it, man. Uh, I, yeah. I, I I literally thought you were going to say the line that doesn't even belong on the page, which is probably tier infinity, which is basically super hype beast for the clip oh. on that just, what just flies out. They need, doesn't, even, <laughs> doesn't even resonate in this planet. He, 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 goes, he goes to uh, planet hyped on. That's where he goes to, bro. He sits there. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, man. But I, I do, y'all got that in common. I do think y'all, both y'all, um, Y'all yeah. go for the oh, I like odd. 
the odd colors yeah. and, and bright colors. Well, TJ board. <laughs> well, not nah, both because you do pastel too. Both of y'all do the, like the yeah, yeah. pastel. Mm-hmm. Like colors. I, I, I think the craziest one I've got is the bio, but a bio hacks. The like Jordan one bio hacks. They, like the colorway on that is absolutely beautiful. Like the, I mm-hmm. fell in love with that sneaker when I saw it. I, it's something about colors. Something about something different all the time because you could, you could get like a black sneaker, white sneaker all the time. Yeah. Like Jordan three whites and all of that stuff. Like you you get that. But when then when a unique colorway comes out, you're like, you know what? That that actually grabs me. I like the color on that. Yeah, I'm a big what the what guy. Oh. Wait, what did you get? Yeah, you yeah. didn't get the biohacks, did you? No, I didn't. Nah. But you, he, so he rocked the votes. Oh, the, uh, nice. one vote the, the the electro orange, and it was another one. See, look, look. That's what I was going to bring oh, up. Oh, oh. Look how you do his laces, bro. <laughs> Look how he got the laces. <laughs> <laughs> like this that man, looks a this mess. man, that looks this a mess, man, bro. <laughs> he go in, bro. He go in and he, and bro, I'm talking about fits. When, if he, put, if he putting on the shoe, much like myself, if he putting it on, the fit is going to be on point. It got to be. Look at him now. Right. If you can see him now, if y'all. <laughs> oh, what yeah, do you yeah, think yeah. about yeah. the shoe dog shoe? A lot of them. They stay on yeah. there. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah have, have, you, have you got, have you got the, what, the fives, bro? No, I didn't get those. I'm, somebody can get you're, them for me. You're, you're getting, you're getting, you're getting a red card. Five. You're getting a red card for that, bro. You like the you what? Ask, you he didn't ask me for what the five. five. He didn't yes, ask did. me for what the five. No, you didn't. You couldn't get them. Yo, yo bro, I'm lie. giving you his red card. We wear the I'm same size. That's we wear the same size, bro. I can't get it. We wear the same size, bro. That's not a lie, man. Exactly. That is a lie. That is a lie, bro. You come first. You know what? You know what? You know what? Hold on. Hold on. I got mm-hmm. my what the fives from overseas. I got my what the fives from in clothing. Gotcha. See? They were pretty did, hard did, to get. I know. I, I, I wasn't sweating it. I, I, I wasn't sweating it. I don't remember you asking me. Yeah, they Come were hard on. to get here. Come on, you know me. Miss Matthew shit. You know I need those. They they went on sale here, bro. Nah. What they doing now? I ain't look that. They, they, they're, 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 they're expensive. They're expensive. Like they're, they're probably not that expensive, but they're like they're about 50, 60 pounds above retail. Yeah, that ain't too bad. Yeah, not too but, bad. But yeah, I, God. And I ain't trying to go the Hong Kong route too. You know what I mean? So you know. <laughs> that, that's not even mentioned. That. No, yo, yo, that, that that word that word is cancelled, bro. Don't mention that, bro. He know what you I mean by it, though. No, you can't, yeah, you can't, yeah. can't mention the overwater stuff here, bro. It's, it's nah, the nah, overwater nah. stuff here, bro. Nah, nah, it's a sublime. It's different, man. It's different nah, what I'm saying. He could have, he could have said something way spicy than what he just said, bro. Mm-hmm. We, we know, we know what we talking about. Y'all Trust don't me. nobody else need to know. <laughs> if you know, you know. That's what I if you know, you, you know, know you know. Right now. Yeah, 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 man, yeah. You know, we get a lot of one of those moments. You know. Listen, bro. I didn't. I didn't <laughs> brought up. A, I didn't brought up a couple of things on the pod yeah. before. You so ninety nine can verify this. Remember when I told you I worked with a guy that told us he had uh, what he said Miami oh, you Hurricanes could... fives <laughs> or Gatorade Elevens too. Ga- he just posted those today. No, no, it was it was the it was the Gatorade five. It was Gatorade that, five at that time. And Miami yes. Hurricanes elevens. Yep, that's what you, it bro, was. You, you, you need to you need to grab his passport. See where he stamped his passport. See how many times he's been to China, bro. Like that, yo, bro. That's that's horrendous, bro. How the hell, you, you know? DHG, he moved. Yeah. <laughs> Coolkicks.com. <laughs> see, DHGate DH is legit for y'all over there. For us over here, when, when we see DHGate... No, DHGate ain't legit not, over not, here, not bro. DH, I'm DH, thinking about DHL. I'm AliExpress. thinking about DHL. I'm thinking oh, about yeah, DHL. DHL. Oh, yeah. 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 When, you get, when you getting packages from DHL... Yeah, bro. Yeah. Shoes yeah. Yeah. Look, when, your secret, when your secret's coming straight rapping, no box, you know what you can't. <laughs> 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 you, you know what I I, I uh, when, when I was first picking up sneakers right there was a lot of like all of this foolery out there because a lot mm-hmm. of people didn't really kind of get clued up about UAs they were they were like oh they, they were they, we still was talking about questions about how UAs are still legit but like 
five, six, seven, or even t- uh, ten years ago, they were talking about, oh, you made it, that's fine. And it, it's got more and more progressively acceptable. But, but like, I've seen videos where I've just ch- ch- checked YouTubers out, and all of a sudden they're opening up packages from DHL in, Amer- in America, and they've got no boxes, and people were like, mm. what are you rocking, bro? Is that is that fake? Yo, bro, <laughs> I, I can't believe the evolution of, of UA, the, next, the acceptability of that. That's crazy, bro. It's crazy. But, but the thing is, the thing is, they got a lot better with those. Yeah, so. and, that, and that's the problem. That, that is the massive problem. That the fact that um, what you got to remember is everything starts at a point, and everything's not that great until it kind of mm-hmm. becomes perfect and polished. And that's what's happened with the UAs. UAs yeah, become so polished and. Per- yeah. uh, <laughs> what the hell is that, bro? Oh, if it start raining. So. Is I that the Chanel work. Vapor Maxes? I was at work Friday. <laughs> <laughs> I was is at that- work Friday. Oh, the Air Ballerinas. <laughs> yeah. the, air, the air twinkle toes flash dance and shit god damn <laughs> twinkle toe max i'm a maniac <laughs> maniac on the floor <laughs> no, bro. i was at the liquor store bro and i see that this lady walked in and i only took a, i only got the, the one picture of her feet bro but if you look at at the 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 pink uh tights mm-hmm. and the leg warmers, I actually fit, no, bro, bro, I actually thought that was skin. Was that, bro? Bro, mm. I actually thought that was skin. She had that's what I thought. I thought somebody <laughs> lying. Bro, she oh had man, black, she had on a black leotard and a pink cr- uh crop top. Dog. God damn. With the, with, <laughs> with these uh, <laughs> with these Taiwan <laughs> with these Taiwan Max uh three sixty. That's oh, a gas man. station joint. <sighs> Facts, bro. I mean, uh, it's, bro, a, it's a dress shoe. It's a dress shoe, a ballerina shoe, and an Air Max at the same time. <laughs> I, 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 I need you guys to address this because the state is. You know what? The state seems like a whole new planet because we don't get gas station sneakers here, bro. In the UK oh, or man. or EU, what? what yeah, can, you need to, bro. Q, you need to do a reel with gas station sneakers bro please do it i i'm, I'm intrigued i'm intrigued to see what gas station sneakers you man, guys listen. get please do it man. bro i'm telling you please do it bro they got it all trust me and it, it's it's different variety based on where you go like you, hey, go, you got fours 12 you got lungs have, 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 jo- <laughs> have, have, have you got the jordans 95s. have you, you got the 13s. jordans with a pump on the side no, 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 They got the Jordan. Like so, they got the Jordan so with the fat Jordan flying. Yeah, <laughs> all that. The cal- the, the, the oh, Jordan on that. <laughs> Please do the real, bro. <laughs> if I was in the states, I would do the real. Please do the real, bro. You need to show us what these gas station sneakers look like, bro. Because I'm intrigued. Because you pull up some pictures, you got some stories. I need to see that. You need to <laughs> show I got, some I'm receipts, thinking, bro. I'm thinking about this one store in particular that I go to pretty often. And they got mm-hmm. the whole line up in the Air Forces, the 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 uh, the Air Max ninety five. They got them, bro. Nineties. Mm-hmm. Go do it, do it, yeah. do it. They just say A I R on them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, the airs. <laughs> <laughs> the airs. Ain't ain't a bit of air in them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, some some, they, some foam. They they use the same plastic from the soda bottles on them things. Facts. <laughs> that is a fact. I'm talking about the hardest plastic you ever put your try to press with your finger, boy. Eee. It's not EVA foam, it's PVA foam, permanent foam. It doesn't move. <laughs> <laughs> right, cool. Is is that is have you got any more questions for um for ninety nine? No, nah, man. I, I don't want to ask the wrong question because he gonna fuck around and try to embarrass me or something. <laughs> he, knows, he knows too much about me. <laughs> we did say we did say the start no snitching <laughs> either it's gonna be now or later on i see you later bro you know how it's gonna be yeah, i'd rather i'd rather do it later i'd rather do it in person you, oh, you, you, you don't want it on you wax got, huh yeah, <laughs> you, got, you got everybody you got everybody wondering this q secrets now bro <laughs> we might have a private private pod session <laughs> <laughs> nah, it ain't no secret, man. It ain't no secret. Uh, nah. <laughs> nah, I'm just messing. Shall we get some? We just crazy yeah. like that, man. So yeah, we just have random events we go to, and something always gonna happen. You know what I mean? But it's all in good fun. You know? Yeah, yeah. All right, let, let's 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 get into some quick strikes today, bro. Yeah. So, so, um, f- go on, bro. First up, um, you. 
99, I know, is a fan of the Jordan 1. Lowe's and highs. Lowe's. You know Lowe's, TJ? Yep. Lowe's? Yep. Like, yeah, I know sneakers. Lowe's low sneakers that I, people... I, 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 know, I, know, I know Lowe's. I'll pick up Lowe's okay. for you. I know Lowe's. Yeah, yeah. So, <laughs> Lowe's. We, we, we do Lowe's and highs. Uh, but, I want to know how much you willing to invest, bro, in your, in your Jordan 1 collection. Because Jordan Brand wants 1300 for the E right here. Both of these. Yeah. Mm. Bro, bro is it, isn't this is this isn't this the Wings um, collection that was predicted to come out last November? Because we we had that whole situation where they were talking about six pairs, which cost each which each of them cost a grand. They were going to be super super crazy, uh, all leather, gold touches, all that. But then do you produce this, bro? This 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 is not it. Uh, look, bro. <laughs> It's, it. it's pure leather which is fine pure leather it probably is expensive right pure mm-hmm. Italian leather I can understand but a thousand pounds nearly a thousand dollars for a lot the lows about 800 I think the highs about 900 something, 900 something but like that's crazy uh, nah, I couldn't and, do it. And, they and, got, they got and, highs too TJ they got highs I know, I know and the highs are about 900 but like, the, the thing is we were just talking about how uh, G, G, like Jordan 1's aren't like more of a sneaker sneaker last week and then now they drop us like it isn't that it looks like it's it looks just weird as well it's just eggshell all over mm. nah, I, I ain't spending that much money on that thing they i i like them bro i like them but mm. i'm not spending no no thousand dollars hell no <laughs> i like them though i i i can see what some things i can wear it to but i ain't spending that much money Bro, this this uh the the low the one on the right mm-hmm. with the uh the all white with the gun bottom, bro. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I I need that right now, like uh yesterday. <laughs> like the tan the tan the tan edges on the leather, bro. This is crazy. I like the highs though. The highs got me. You know what I mean, I like yeah, the no, thing. The highs ridiculous. For for for, for 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 nine hundred pounds for nine hundred dollars, bro. No, no for for, for one eighty, two twenty. I'll give you. I give him collab price. I give him. I yeah. give him two ten. Two fifty. Two ten. Two fifty. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I, I can I can name you a sneaker right this moment in time that probably takes not takes some probably is as equivalent not the same kind of specs not the same design but mm-hmm. it is in the same realm. It's the Union One that released last year, bro. That Facts. to me, with the paneling, mm-hmm. is exactly the same sneakers. That they're not probably the yeah. materials. I know the. And let's not even talk about materials. Let's not cap about materials. That that material is pure leather. Like yeah. the Union One's not pure leather. That, that's, that, right, let's right, be real right. here, right? But when we ain't gonna put that kind of sauce on it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> nah. yeah, yeah. But when when I, when I talk about a sneaker with similarities, like the Union One, we know is based on the neutral grey. That looks like it's based on the neutral grey one as well. But with the paneling, with the undertones, with the yellow undertones, that's a Union 1, bro. But that's the Union 1 hyped up without the foot skate and with better leather. Pretty much, bro. If, if I look yeah. at that sneaker. Yeah. Yeah. I mean... But, which... and, and you know that's going to be super super limited, super crazy. Um, It's gonna it's like another Dior. It's another Dior, yeah. but not a Dior. So basically, yeah. all, they did, all they put was a sneaker wrap on it. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> pretty much, bro. Pretty much. They, 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 they try to they try to make like Birkin Birkin ones or something. Bro. Yeah, yeah they, they, there's gonna be like a hundred pairs of each, and they're gonna get auctioned off, bro. I can see. Oh it. yeah, I can see it. All celebs and stuff gonna get it. You know what I mean? So yeah, yeah. That, that, that's not for us. I really yeah, hope they wear them, bro. Yeah, but that this that low, bro. <sighs> I mean the highs, the highs crazy too, but for, I'm just partial to OG lows for some reason right now. Especially and, the gun bottom, the bottom sole, so it kind of looked different. They killed that. The, the design yeah. on them, I can't be even the eggshell one with the blue swoosh. I ain't mad at. Yeah, I ain't, I ain't got no. So, no so we we see, we seen three, we seen three, two lows and one high. Apparently, with the the codes that came out last year, it was three highs. 
and, and three, three lows. lows. So we've seen two lows. We're going to see another one in full time. We'll see what happens with that. And we've seen mm. two more highs come out in full time. We'll see what happens with that. Yeah, this this wasn't official. Like, no, you know, no. they they were, they showed them on purpose, but this wasn't like, you know, a real no, out of no. that. So. No, they no, just, they, it's they just, it's just teasing. Waters. Yeah, they yeah. testing the waters, put, put the information out there and let the people get, the people that, that want them get excited. Want to get them. But yeah. I want to know how excited y'all are, especially you right now, being from New York. Babe, got shell tools for y'all now. <laughs> Ain't you excited, bro? Hell no, nah, man. <laughs> I I. For the life of me, when those things came out, all to me always looked like some knockoff Air Force One lows, man. <laughs> always. You said it. You said it, bro. And Bape Stars you, are coming back. Bape yeah, Stars seem yeah. to be coming back with some. Why though? I don't know. Hello. They, they, they in a lawsuit, oh. bro. Yeah, no, no, but uh, they, they are, they are, but like uh, I think with Nigo going over to um, Nike, it could be su- smoothing that whole lineup. To be honest, bro, listen, my daughter wants these for whatever reason. <laughs> <laughs> you, you get them, you get them, you, you, you'll be able to get them, definitely. So, I, I, think they, I, think, I think they're nice. Q? I think they're nice. No, Q? No, no. Well, I'm, I'm gonna have to call you. Shell toes, shell toes, the Air Force One make, in make, one. Yo, yo, 99, 99, <laughs> bro, 99. Bro. On the day, on the one day before the release, pick up the phone and say, Q, I need those bape stars. Can you go in the shop for me? He will not touch him. <laughs> he, he will throw holy water on him and run away, bro. <laughs> bro, these, these things, these things is $295, bro. Hey, no, 280, cool. 285. When hey. they coming out? 285, bro. They out now. Oh, you know, she got a birthday coming up, Q, so. <laughs> I might be on her list. <laughs> I will see, I can Yo, see Q. the link right now, bro. I Q, really Q, Q. What, what sizes have they got in stock at the moment? So live, live check. A live check. <laughs> All of them. Should, should, we do a, should we do a live cop for 99 right this moment in time? Let's, let's no. sweat a bit. <laughs> no. <laughs> sizes, nope. sizes 8 through 13 are available. Mm-hmm. Okay. There you go. They got the white ones too. Hold on. Let me, let me, you want me to find the nah, white ones for nah, you? Nah, she like that one, like that color, probably. Let's yeah, have a look at the white ones. The white one too. 285. They're okay. They're okay. They're okay. The white one looks a little bit more cleaner. The white one looks cleaner. This is not okay, bro. It's not because it's like a DD tonight, them joint forces. No, hey, bro. hey, <laughs> that's hey, a good one. If you, if you, yo, if you don't like Nike, you can go for the Babe Star yeah. shirt. Yeah, it's like it's like a it's like a what was it? Maybe a, a Hyundai, and she was like a, a Lexus in the front and a Mercedes in the back. Yo, bro. yo, yo, yo. I'll, I'll t- let me tell you. Let me tell you a funny story, right? Basically, I went. I linked up with Polar. Polar came from the states over here, and we went to Selfridges, which is a big, like, big store that does all multiple kind of like. It's like a mall, but a store. Um, and then we went to Offspring. We had a look look around, and next to Offspring, you got all of the like Amiri and Bape and all of that stuff. And Polo walked through, and he just shook his head like, and he looked at the Amiri Jordan ones with the skeletons uh, look look vibe to him, and he just looked like, why, why, why? Yeah, it was that was a funny. Like you know, what? it's so funny to see that reaction from somebody that just doesn't like anything like this hype hype like that in terms of um, high value. Items like that. He was like, nah, nah, can't do it. No, bro, this is not three hundred dollars, three ten for some knockoff Air Force One, bro. So, <laughs> no, so no. so it's not it. Definitely not no, it. Slash bro. Adidas, slash Adidas. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> two eighty five for the for the bootleg shell toe, the fufu shell toes. Mm. Two- <laughs> Those some gas station shoes, Q. Them gas station bakes. You, you see what I'm saying? <laughs> You see what I'm oh, saying, bro? Okay, okay. <laughs> you, 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 you guys have just given me an idea, right? A live idea, yeah. right? <laughs> live <Yeah>. idea. <laughs> What's one sneaker you condemn to the gas station to live there forever and never come Ooh. out? <laughs> now that's a question. One sneaker mm. that you, like, we're talking about, you lock it in the gas station and never sees the light of day. How much is it? Is it, it, it twelve dollars? 
Does hey. bro, you could you could do whatever you want with it. You know you know what? Them damn trash ass uh Geezy alien boots that fat Jill tried to hype. <laughs> Get him out Oh of yeah. Here. Oh yeah. Get him out of here. Get him out of here, bro. Create the does, sick ghost. Send him does a it him. Put them under the shelf at BP, under the coffee stand yeah. at BP. And, Does it have to be a shoe? Does it have to be a sneaker or just any kind of yeah. shoe? Anything, bro. bro. Those, anything, bro. The, those, uh, the moon red, the red, the red shoes that everybody was rocking. They can't get their feet out of them. The Balenci- That's the name of them. Oh, red boot, the big, the big red boot, big red boot. No, the, no, no. Yeah. Not the, big red boots. The ones that like the damn video game. Yeah, big red boots. Yeah, yeah those shit. They can go. <laughs> they can go. Those and every variation of the croc one, all of them can go to the gas station. Croc one. And they can put it next to the rat snacks at the gas station. Rat snacks. <laughs> you, you know what? You know what? That, 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 that's a hard... That's a hard question. Yeah. I don't know what I'd put in there. I w- I don't know what I'd put in there. No, no, you gotta pick. You gotta pick. We get we went first. Okay. You gonna put them? Um, gonna put them? Put them next to the uh, sweetest fish. I, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna <laughs> put the whole brand. I'm gonna I'm gonna put sketches in there. You belong in gas station. <laughs> the whole brand. <laughs> okay. Yeah, whole brand. Okay. Sketches. I was I was that was my next one. That was close. I like that one, PJ. I was yeah. like, oh, it's, it's, either that, especially. Either that or the new Balance Basketball Edition joints. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The six, those six fifties. They, they, they didn't, work. they didn't do well. Uh, they, no, they, you know what? I, I think no. He's talking about Kawhi's. No, the Kawhi Kawhi's. Leonard's, Zach oh, Levine, okay. all them dudes. Zach Levine, go over there too, then. Shea Gill yes. Alexander, all them dudes, man. You, you, you know, you know what? I really want to put. You know why I put sketches in there? I saw the foolishness that they did with the Yeezy brand when they actually took the colorways and put the, put it on the sketches. Oh, now, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's that oh. trash, bro. <laughs> trash, bro. Like, yeah. you, how can you do that? How do you, how that's do you, exactly, like, that's you exactly not, why they belong. Yeah, exactly. Gas station, bro. Like, you, you, yo, you might as well put some lights on the outside and glow in the dark on them because you know what? You want to do everything to that sneaker. I'm surprised Q, I'm surprised Q agreed, man. What? Why? Q got a few Heelys, don't you, bro? It's all it's it's all coming out now. It's all coming out now. You try you try to get me out of character. You try to get me out of character. Uh, I'm not gonna fall for it. I'm not gonna fall for it. I'm not gonna fall. Cause you know you know damn what you know what? You know what? I do got uh them jump mans that I wear to work, them them, mm-hmm. them team Jordans I wear to work, and I got another pair of team Jordans that would never see the light of day that I actually wore outside years ago when I was off sneakers. Mm-hmm. And I just, you know, I just needed some new shoes, so I just bought whatever but they was Jordans. I shouldn't yeah. have done that. You know, <laughs> I'm, I'm yeah. gonna that decision right now when I, cause I could have bought some Forces or some little Air Max or something like that. But I bought some <laughs> Team Jordans, and I, I won't get rid of them. They will probably die in my garage, in the box, the way uh, <laughs> old boy uh, White Cement Foes died. <laughs> you know uh-huh. what I'm saying? Cause they won't be worn unless I probably have to wash the car. Or, you know what? I don't even want to disrespect them like that. I'm I'm wearing yeah. the other pair to work, so they getting that's, some that's cool some play. They getting some play. You know what I mean? But they getting beat I, up though, so you don't care about some things. No, nah, I don't. They team okay. Of mm-hmm. course, I don't. it's work. You don't get criticized for work. I do have a pair of six rings in my collection right now, mm. and I always forget about them. But I do have them. I got something. I got two Team Jordans that I, I can know of. I got the Russell Westbrooks. Yeah. And I hoop in those. And I got the Mars 20, 270s. The, the Hornet Oh, colors. yeah, 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 yeah. The yeah, Hornet yeah. colors. No, the uh, West, I, I wouldn't count Westbrook as team because he's a signature athlete. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So as long as it's his signature sneaker, I wouldn't count that as. But he part of the man. team, though, man. But it, I, I, I it's still a hundred, category. It's, like, it's under $120. I, 
I'm saying like the Spizite <laughs> ain't necessarily a team Jordan. It's the Spizite. It's respected yeah, as yeah, its yeah, own it's more, yeah. signature it's more hybrid. silhouette. You know what I mean? It's a hybrid. But, it's yeah, a hybrid. That's different though. It's, that's Spike though. Yeah. You know, that's different. That's what I'm yeah, saying. Was, it's Russ. Yeah, yeah. Russ yeah, is yeah, super. I was gonna say. I was gonna say. What's the best what hybrid sneaker? Like in terms of like you would like it's a hybrid sneaker. It's just like the three one two. Just like the six rings. What what, mm-hmm. what is what is your favorite hybrid sneakers? Because like let's not play hybrid sneakers down there. Some of them are really dope. Yeah, oh yeah. Dunsey, uh three one two. Yeah, yeah. Very dope. Very. Dope. I like the I like the Spizikes and the Don three one twos. Very dope yeah. sneakers. Yeah, yeah. Like, very, very me. underrated. Yeah, it's Spizikes like, to I, me, man. Yo, bro, the the, the year the Jordan Spizikes, the green and white version, so dope, so so dope. I like the yeah, uh, the black and green with the purple. That's. Sh- mm. mm. I, 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 I want love some that of those. One. I want some of those Spiz uh, Spizikes to um, they come coming. out. I don't know. They I, I hope fingers, them, fingers them Houston crossed. them Houston uh, lows. They 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 making a little bit of noise, man. I seen a lot bro. of. I'm seeing a lot of positive comments about those. I, 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 I saw that in hand. I went to Offspring and I saw that in hand. Mm. That's dope. So dope. So, so dope. But the the, the so quad no cut. left. It's okay. Yeah, I'm not. Uh. I know, I know. I know. <laughs> I'm not, I'm, I, I, yo, bro. Um, The quality, the, the materials on that new buck for that sneaker. So nice. So, so nice. So nice. Next quick strike, please. Next quick strike. The Grammys happened and we won. Killer Mike yeah. swept the rap categories. Three Nathan. I told y'all when his album came out. After whatever episode it was, I told y'all right here on the Shoot Down podcast oh. that Killer Mike had the best album mm-hmm. out in twenty twenty. Talking to me and shit. I mm-hmm. told y'all it was album of the year. I don't, I might not have told you. <laughs> I don't know if we talked about the Killer Mike album. But nah. I said it on this podcast. Yeah, mm-hmm. we talked about it. The world agrees. I don't care nothing about what Kasanet had to say about it. Kasanet, what, 19, 20 years old? He ain't got to know who Killer Mike is. That's okay. <laughs> yeah. Killer Mike going to introduce himself to Kasanet. So, hey, I hope we put you in the album credits. Damn. No, I don't need no credit. I am the West Side. I'm, I'm, I'm surprised he doesn't know. I don't, I'm, I'm surprised he doesn't know Run the Jewels. I'm surprised, bro. Bro, Killer Mike made that album for me and people that that grew up the way. Oh yeah, we for did. sure. So yeah. you know what I mean, like, and, and it's so many jewels and lessons and just dopeness. You know what I mean in that album. So mm-hmm. shout out to Killer Mike. I just had to say all that. But mm-hmm. Travis dropped the cut the check mochas during the Grammys, and it was a mess. Yep. <laughs> a it's huge like, mess. It's like the Zions with the air raid bottoms. Mm. You never seen mm. these? Huh? You ain't seen these, huh? Yeah, I seen them. I'm just saying. Okay, okay. You get, you get that, yours, huh? Yeah, you got that yeah. Zion strap with the air raid bottom. Yeah, bro. Love it. It's, I'm, I'm it's a, tr- it's a full on trainer, bro. Like, yeah. Mm-hmm. He. he he rolled out he rolling out with the uh commercials and, and all that now i don't want him no less <clears throat> i don't want him no more than i did before but it's gonna be pandemonium bro they mm-hmm. dropped, yeah they dropped they was 170 i think and they reselling for like three thousand you already yeah, know. That, that, that's 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 cap though that's cap that's cap like um, I'm going to be honest, that's just real cap. Um, well, immediately we, after, immediately yeah. after the release, they were selling for three thousand. Yeah, yeah, but I, I did. The thing is, like, I don't know how many pairs released. It could be super limited. This could be a promotional hype thing. There's, ba- right. bro, there could be, they could, this could be a massive release. This could do like air, air, air force. No, no, air force. Air Max One vibes because this could be like we talked about. This could be, air, this could be like the Air Max One, readily available. But it, they're gonna drop it in small spurts at the start to build up the hype. It's a beautiful. You keep sneaker. saying that, bro. You keep saying that. Did you, yeah, did you mean Air Trainer one? No, no. I mean the Air, Air Max one. It was not readily available like that. You saying bro, you bro. saying that like it was easy to get? In the UK, it was. And they, they pretty, I think there was more pairs in the UK than it was in the states. Uh, if I'm mm. honest, because it, you, you, UK and Europe are, is the Air Max uh, city. To be honest, 
it wasn't it wasn't easy to get here i tried to get the uh well of course the the exclusive wheat mocha colorway that only dropped on his website was hard to get but mm-hmm. um the brown ones and the yellow i did i i don't think i went for the yellow ones for the Saturn, uh, Saturn gold yeah the saturn yeah i ain't go for those yeah. but the the brown ones hard to get bro and i don't think i don't think these are gonna be easy at all no, no, no. It's not, it's not going to be easy, no. but I, I, it's, it's not going to be. Look, I'm going to. I'm going to be honest. It's not going to be a Jordan One low Travis Scott. It's not going to be that. It's going to be like we talked about in the realms of like an Air Max One Travis Scott kind of vibe. Because I, I, I think for for a first signature sneaker, they either can do two things: make it super limited, very really hard to get, and and over like basically unattainable or they could just give it to a lot of people so let's just see what happens with the release i hope it's the second one because i do believe anybody that wants that sneaker should be able to get that sneaker it's a nice colorway i like i like the vibe it's, it, to me that's me like trainer 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 vibes that's me 100 percent. that strap on the top yeah that's me so so after, so after this one you think they're gonna water it down with a whole bunch of different colorways bro we there's four, four apparently there's four is yeah well i make me yeah, more you know, you know how they do certain sneakers now Yo, bro, oh, no. the three, the three Jordan One Low Travis Scotts coming out this year, apparently, yeah. okay, allegedly, and there's four of these. This Travis year, but you might as well cancel. Don't call it 2024. Call it Travis year. That is Travis year. <laughs> I got you. Bro, uh, how, 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 how? When's the last time you saw this many Travis Scott? And we, we we're yeah. talking about just what we know. He might mm-hmm. do more. Who knows? Yeah. So what I think they should do is stick with them four colorways and treat it like. A, a basketball sneaker like like mm-hmm. a seasonal you know once a year og colorways and maybe in 20 years there'll be a, a travis 20 and then they'll start re-retro in travis ones with new yeah. colorways similar to how jordan's uh sneaker career went you know what i mean yeah mm-hmm. that would be dope to see we don't know yeah, yeah. if it's gonna be like especially with an artist like I mean, we know Travis the man, but yeah, is he gonna be the man in twenty years still? Yeah, because he's not hooping. Exactly, and we know yeah. sports. Sports, you know, you get a finite amount of time. Like, if, if you don't come right in with a, because he didn't come right in with a signature sneaker. He he been with Nike for like six, seven years now, and mm-hmm. he's just not getting a signature sneaker. So maybe four. Three or four different silhouettes, but just do yeah. just do four just do four, four five maybe. I mean, most of the Jays had four OG colorways. Mm-hmm. Just do four OG colorway. He should do a Houston yeah. colorway though every time. But I guess this yeah, mocha yeah, yeah. is the mocha is his signature colorway. Yeah, so. do, do, if if he's you know what it would have been intelligent. I don't know if it, if if they've geared it up like this, but he's got if he's got four sneakers or four silhouettes coming out or four check, cut the chips coming out. It will, it will be quite interesting to see if he, he actually drops in spring, summer, autumn, winter, and basically all the colorways reflect the colors of that actual season. That would be quite dope if he did that because yeah. the mocha variation, yeah. the mocha variation is more all to me. Um, if he brought a bright colorway to summertime, like the, the 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 yellow, the yellow canary yellow ones, it, it's prime time, summer's tight sometime. If mm-hmm. he actually did that with the cut the check, I'm talking just cut the check, not the Jordan one lows. If he did that with the cut the check sneakers, it would be dope. Like if we expect him one to release in or like All Star Weekend to like March time, that's that's almost like springtime. Uh, if he releases one summertime, auto winter time, winter time you can do like a more of a, a all butters wheat or even like a cold blue vibe steel vibe colorway. That would be dope. Like give it some seasonal colorways, give it some different color color palettes. It would be quite dope if you did actually did that. Mm-hmm. We'll see, man. I I just don't I don't see it being a. Uh as big of a release as you think it is i think gonna, yeah, no i i, I, think I, I might, I'm, I'm 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 thinking of it from a sneakerhead perspective it would be good if they did that but no, no, yeah, i know the realism sure. from a from, from a realistic point of view a first signature sneakers are gonna be super limited like um I, I was mentioning this on the review for the craft threes. Every craft variation that we've got for a Jordan has been really hard to get. I'm surprised at the amount of people that didn't cop the, the photon dust uh, fours or didn't cop the actual craft threes that I did the review on because they just went. They disappeared. Like, I know in the States they sat, but in the UK they went. They literally dis- disappeared off the planet, off the face of the earth, bro. And everybody in the UK is now paying that resale for those craft threes. Yeah. Mm. That's how Crazy. it happens. <laughs> yeah. Mm. But next quick strike, bro. Yo, you know, you... Uh, 
You know who Mischief is, bro? Who? Hey, cool. Mischief. You ever heard of Mischief? Mm-hmm. You know about the uh, FWD? <laughs> the sneaker that you can wear backwards and forwards? Uh, nah. Okay, this is gonna be good. All right, so th- th- this this F the BWD is basically a sneaker that wow. you can wear both ways. Okay. Yeah, the BWD you can wear from toe toe to heel or heel to toe. So basically, it's a versatile sneaker you can wear backwards or forwards, right? So if you if you if you're <laughs> you, basically people don't know if you're coming or going, right? So that's that's the <laughs> BWD, right? Yeah. And the F the FWD, which Q's gonna show you now, it's the second variation of t- of the BWD, and that's the most normal mischief sneaker they've ever created and it looks no, the not. most normal what's the, what's the most normal sneaker they've created they they got more normal stuff this is just the most normal thing that they actually pushing yeah like their they, own the own sneaker no, I'm, talk, I'm not talking about 97s i'm not talking about whatever they've done previously i'm talking about right this moment in time this is the most normal sneaker that they've created from fresh i like it bro yeah i do i'm, yeah, I'm, I'm not going I'm, I'm really not going to buy it, <laughs> but I think it's, <laughs> it's, I think right. it's, yeah, I'm glad they, I'm glad they flipped it around and made it look like, cause it's, it's like, a, it's like a dope skate shoe. Yeah. Is yeah, that, yeah. or it, it kind of reminds me of the Converse's back in the, like not back in the day, but like the Larry Johnson con- um, Converse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Black tops that, and stuff like that. Yeah. The little Kevin, oh, I was thinking, Kevin Johnson and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, black so, top uh, Reeboks and, and Converse, the Grandma Ma's. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's definitely Grandma Ma, that bottom. So, so sure. the, the question, the question is then, Arrow is Jam. mischief Converse Arrow Jam? That's the name. Of the mm-hmm. Yeah, go ahead, bro. So the, so, so the question, so the question is, is mischief now? Starting to evolve into a, a real not 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 the fact they're not a real brand from, from a more of a um, artistic point of view to more of a uh, not take us seriously with actually doing sneakers now properly, or is this just it, like the take? I mean, look like a casual shoe. So going back from that front backwards shit, uh, you could say they <laughs> trying to take it serious. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I, I think I think. Um might be underestimating <laughs> or overestimating I, mischief yeah i, because, I want to see uh, what the next next release is if, if we if we work out what their next release is we'll work out what what direction they're taking bro <laughs> Wait, gonna put I'm, some... I'm not i'm not gonna allow y'all to do this to mischief okay <laughs> Mission. Oh Don't yeah, think. I I showed you this. I showed you, yo, did your bro, bring it up, bring it up, bring it up, bring it up. This is dope. This is the most dopest thing I've ever seen Mischief do. What are you talking about? This is dope. You ain't showing me this. This is, I, I, bro, I, sh- I, sh- I sent this to you on your DMs. I, I did, if I didn't, I sent it to somebody else. This is the ASCII code cinema, basically. This is so dope. Go on, Q, talk, talk through it. I don't even know what this is, bro. I never... So. So this is this is coded. Basically, this is a this is like code language cinema. So every they, 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 what they've done this. is re- I did see yeah. this on IG. You're right. Yeah, yeah. So so they, basically, what what they've done is mischief have got a movie and actually co- co- coded it in a way. Basically, it's all numbers and colors, and it actually replays the movie, but without making it copyright. <laughs> in terms of you using the code to play a movie, but you see it in like a more almost like a pixelated view. And that's what that is. And they've actually opened this up to buy tickets to go and watch movies in this way. This is just so crazy, bro. I like when they did that. This is like magical to see. Yeah. And, they, and they're still selling uh, cologne. Yeah. And bri- see, look, the super normal is called the super normal. Like, it's, that's the one of the more normal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But yeah. they still got the big black boot on sale. Oh, God. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Gas station the- boot. <laughs> right, super baby. They got the super, super baby. Well. You know what I'm saying? They still got the the uh, the AC one hospitals. <laughs> they still oh that briefcase, the yo bro bro, the Italian yeah, bag, the bag brown briefcase. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's dope. That's dope. And they still selling the, the giant Fruit Loop. It's just a box, a cereal box with one big ass Fruit Loop in it. 
<laughs> you know what I mean? So, mischief ain't going nowhere, bro. They ain't going nowhere. Yo, they I, they can sprinkle in these normal or regular wearing uh, sneakers to you know keep it keep it interesting, but. Yeah, Come yeah, on, yeah. Uh, yo, the the the, the uh, BWD was hundred thirty five dollars. That equates to like one ten. And then, yo, I might I might have to look at that if it restocks. <laughs> <laughs> let's see, let's see, let's see how much the FWD is, bro. <laughs> I want to see that in hand. <laughs> No problem. Just for the sh- <laughs> just for the shits and giggles, I want to see that in hand. Right, cool. Right, Shall we move on to the next week's right, bro? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Right, next quick strike is basically um, we're going to talk about the Amma Manier because basically it looks like we're going to get two more Amma Manier variations. We're po- most likely going to get uh, another Amma Manier 4, which is I think confirmed for July time, and uh, Amma Manier 3, which is confirmed for September time. So apparently that's the that's the trend at the moment. That's what's going to happen, or that's what's being predicted to happen. So we looks like we're going to get three variations. Don't mind the colorways at the moment because these are predicted. We've seen the Amma Manier 4 look that variation. Obviously, let's have a look at um, what actually comes out with official pictures. We don't know what the Amma Manier 3 looks like, but obviously these are the two variations that we've seen. It's going to be interesting. What Would you mind the Amma Manier 3 looking like the Amma Manier 4 that's released? Yeah, I, mean, I like the colours. Huh? It's cool. Yeah. Hey, that's, that's, that's Very the laid one, back. The, the 4 is pretty much what we've seen, but yep. the 3 we ain't seen yet. I don't yeah. want the three to look nothing like what we didn't got already. Yeah. What? Would you, what? What do you think of the, like? I know. I know. We talk about mock ups. So what do you think of this like early mock up from Z Sneaker? It's cool. If it came, if it came out like that, it, it would be dope. If with the, you know, would it be suede or would it be leather? Is the question. Mm. I think it would be cool if it was the same leather from the four. Mm-hmm. Instead of the gray uh, suede that we got on the first threes. I think mm-hmm. that'd be cool, but it's our that'd speculation. Cool. I don't want it. Yeah, it's all, it's all, it's all, mm. it's all speculation. But are you, are you guys happy to see more Amma Maniers? Oh, obviously, we all happy to see more Amma Maniers come out. But more Amma Amma <laughs> Freeze and Force come out. That's a silly question. I should not ask silly questions on the podcast. We're all happy to see more sneakers come out. But yeah, in, t- in terms of just 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 another free variation, another full yeah. variation. Are you happy to see that come out? Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, for sure. Mm-hmm. So yeah, the, my my. Mark your calendars at the moment. It looks like Amma Munir 3 will be dropping on the 18th of July. Apparently, that's what's, that's what's been said. And Amma Munir 4 will be dropping in September time. So, um, yeah, it's collaboration season, bro. Like, we, we already talked, we talked about Travis dropping what he's going to drop. Amma Munir dropping what they're going to drop. They're probably going to drop a, more, a lot more. Khaled was rumoured to have a collaboration coming out with Jordan Brand. I don't know what's happened with that. There's, there's going to be so much this year, bro. It, it's, yeah, I we'll, we'll talk we'll talk in the next couple of podcasts about this because I've got theory behind this anyway. But, yeah, great, great news. A lot of people that, a lot of people that love Amma Munir are going to love these sneakers. That's all I'm saying. We'll see. You copying both, bro, bro? I'm just glad, I'm just glad he, uh, on the threes, there ain't always no blue shit on it this time. Because all he dropped is blue, blue, blue this, blue that, blue that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We we got, how many blue threes in the past couple of years? Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, you, oh, you mean, you mean the Navy, the Wizards and all that stuff? Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey. Columbia, so, everything. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so, so guys, look out in July time, which is quite, even though it's still far, it's still really close. So July time and September time for those Amman and years. Let's just see what's going to happen. But next, quick strike, bro. And this is going to whet everybody's appetite because, you know, we've been hearing rumours about Cortez and the fact that we might be getting another Cortez collaboration with Nike. Mm. And uh, but apparently, this is all speculation, but there's three variations of this Harachi High coming out. There's Oof. apparently, uh, this is this is mm. a speculation. There's this is not facts. This is speculation. We're we're just speculating about the colorways. So we like we got three we got three ninety sevens um, that came out. It wasn't sorry ninety fives that came out. Um, we got those and they were regional and they were exclusive. And Cortez what they did 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 what they did in the states, the Paris and U- and UK, which is crazy. I think the same thing's gonna happen with these three. Like we're gonna get we're gonna get exclusive regional variations, which is gonna be I like Paris, States, and the UK again. And I don't know where these colorways drop in, but apparently one of them, well, according to the sketches, it's this is the sketches. One of them looks uh, one of the white variation, one's a grey variation, one's a totally black variation. It's all camo underneath as well with the lining. But yeah, um, 
Let me know your thoughts, guys, because I think this is absolutely dope if this comes out. Yeah, I need the black ones. <laughs> Instant. The gray ones. Hey, I'm a Harachi guy. I love those. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give me all three. <laughs> Give me all three. Give me all three. All white, the all white ones, too? Hey, bro, you know how I am about Harachis, bro. Give me all three just to have Yo, them, that, bro. It, it looks like the, the gu- there's a gum outsole to that or pure white Harachi. No, all white Harachi. It looks like yeah, from look, the sketch. It's a got, gum. Uh, gum outsole. No, no, no. That's the that, black one that doesn't. cocaine. I, I don't think the black one does. The grey one looks like it does. It's it, we we were speculating because obviously these are sketches, yeah. but it looks like we are expecting to see free Harachi High you know, Cortez collaborations. Um, bro, I, I I can I can see like they did with the pink variation of the Cortez Nike. I can see something not being exactly what we're seeing here. I I think there might be different colorways or different colors that come to the sneaker that we ain't seeing at this moment in time. So this is all speculation. I think everybody's just wetting their appetite at the moment to see what the actual final product's going to look. But this is amazing. And I do believe we might see more Harachi highs going forward from this collaboration, which would be amazing because I know a lot of UK guys love Harachi highs, especially Ben. We talked about him trying to get Harachi highs as well. Yeah, this is crazy, this is, bro. Like, this is not the same Harachi, though. You thinking about yeah, no. the basketball Harachi. Yeah, this yeah, I'm talking about the trainer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bo Jackson, but, quote unquote. Right. Yeah. So what, this, this what's your one, initial thoughts? This, this one, uh, what you mean? I'm just saying, what, 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 you know, I know you, I know you like the black one, but are you glad to see this come about? Right. What? What? <laughs> Ain't nothing bad about Harachis, dog. Like, the more the more Harachis we get, the better off the world is. Like, Harachis are for the world. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> like, what you What you prefer? ACG, Harachi highs or Harachi the, lows? ACG Harachis, Harachi highs, Harachi lows. Harachi trainers, uh, Harachi t-shirts, Harachi socks, mm. Harachi, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Harachi, Harachi, Harachi. Harachi. <laughs> <laughs> Everything, bro. Jordan sevens. I mean, the eights. The eights got the got got the uh, the booty from the Harachi two still in them. So mm-hmm. yeah, man. Like Harachi me down, bro. I don't wear Harachi lows. I, I have yet to cop Harachi highs because I'm waiting on the right colorway. I'm gonna be quiet. Uh, Harachi two Ks mm, need to come mm, back yeah. too. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah. They yep. dropped the Kobe uh Harachis, mm. so why not do the the Kobe two Ks? Like everybody, yep, a lot yep. of and the uh, comfortable basketball shoe. Bro, a lot of yeah. people waiting on 2K Harachis to come back. I had the all black ones when they dropped. Was hooping them thing, man. Listen, yeah, bro, bro Har- Harachi is such a comfortable sneaker. I like when when I first started. Uh, I think I had an all triple black Harachi low. Yo, comfortable, bro. Comfortable sneaker, very yeah. comfortable. Yeah, yeah man. So it, anything, especially trainer wise, because I know there's one, well, hell, all three of us, we, all three of us love trainers. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so. You know, we need we just need more Harachis, bro. More trainers, more Harachis, and we getting it. We getting we got the basketball ones already. We getting Dion's. We getting mm-hmm. you know they brought they brought Barclays back. You know what I'm saying the phones coming back. Everything seemed like everything we want is finally starting to come back around now that the the resale craze on retro Jordans is dying. Now yeah. Nike yeah. is Nike pumping us. Full of nostalgia now, you know what I mean, and I love it, bro. Hell, we were just talking about the era. Just I never thought that she would come back. Yeah, me neither. Yeah, but there's 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 no there's no set release date for this. There's no set um to, uh, like when it's gonna it come matter. out. We might see. Yeah, it don't it's matter. Already, we it's we already might... over. Yeah, yeah. Well, they, they one, were, they, to be... This one of them things, bro. I don't know if you uh aware of what happened with the last Cortez, the ninety Air Max ninety five Cortez. Mm-hmm. This, this we don't even know when it's gonna happen, and it's already over. Yeah, you yeah. I mean? so, and you, you, you know, and you know those uh ninety five Harachi um Nike um ninety five Cortez are actually going for really really crazy prices yeah, at one like time. Yeah, like five six hundred something like that. Yeah, that's bro. Not that, that 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 that's that that's the pair that's not desired. The pairs that are I desired are eight hundred. Yeah, they eight like the blue ones are eight hundred. I think no. 
blue ones are 500. <laughs> the, no, the, the pink, pink variation, the 800. I They're 800. The I want the blue. No, no, no. Yeah, but like you, you can did the these Harachi highs. Yeah, they're gonna be quite expensive in the long run as well. Like Cortez are doing it; they're killing it, absolutely dope. And round of applause for Cortez, hundred percent. Yeah, Clint, shout out to Clint, man. Yeah, shout out to Clint four one nine. Yeah, absolutely dope, absolutely dope. I I can't wait for that. They, we'll give you more progress of what happens um in terms of when that release is coming out later. As soon as we know, you know. But yeah, crazy, crazy, crazy sneaker. And I can see 99 is loving these Harachi. I, I want you to say, you know what? I yeah. want you to say Harachi, Harachi, Harachi one more time. That Harachi, was Harachi, time. Harachi. <laughs> 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 Love Harachi, man. <laughs> yeah, the blue one is, oh, like 700 right now. In my yeah, they, they're going up. They're going up. We're and um, yeah, We all wear the same size. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? Yeah, that's I, that's quite of a, a, a dead given today. We all wear US 11 UK tents. Damn. Yep. So I've been fighting with you guys to get my sneakers. Yeah, basically. No, no. I've been fighting with 99 to get my sneakers. <laughs> now I'm fighting with you. Did you come first? <laughs> the plug comes first all the time. The I got to hold, the, I gotta hold the wife head. Shit. <laughs> well, you know what? I, I really ain't been tapping her as much as I uh, used to. I've been giving her a break. So Yeah. I, you, you you know what you need to do, Q, right? Every time she, at 99 tells you he wants a sneaker, give him an L plate, right? Like a driver's L plate. And like and then until until you get the sneaker, you can swap the L plate. See what I'm saying? That's your reservation. That's your plug <laughs> reservation. Give him the L plate. <laughs> you stupid. <laughs> <laughs> what? You, you got your that. and that, that's that, no no that's that's facts though. You got an L to you got a W. So you you ain't got a sneaker. Oh you man, got a sneaker. That's, that's like premeditating the L, bro. That's uh, <laughs> Can't do that, give man. no, no, but, but give him two L plates. You can turn it to a W. <laughs> no, no. But see, the thing about it is, bro, with being friends, like I always, I'm always honest. You know what I'm saying? And bro yeah. knows, like he's at the, he's at the top of my list. So most of the time, when he's asking, he knows I'm the only person in front of him. Yeah. So it, he's, as long he's the as same. I don't want it. He gets the full privilege. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It, but like, he's the same with me. Yeah, the same cause, with me. Like cause he, my account, yeah. our accounts, you know what I'm saying? It's really our accounts because we've been doing yeah. it so much. So yeah, man, it's 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 me and black because we all wear pretty much the same size. But mm-hmm. black usually don't ask first. Bro, ninety nine to ask first, so he all he stayed at the top of the list. Yeah, I know. I know when black gonna act because actually got some yellow in it and it's black, it's green. It's green. That's what he want. Same thing with me, but you know, he can have the yellow what? shit. You, I, I got this locked. I know 99 secret now. What he actually does, right? He gets his 16 year old daughter to look at all the new sneakers that are coming out to send to him. No. So every time he see, no, no, no. Every time, look, look, stay with me. Like he, he, I know this. I, I clocked him already. Every time he sees a yellow or gray green colorway, he picks up the phone to you. Yo, Q, I need this. Don't, don't make sure black don't get this. I need this before him though. Don't trust me. Trust me. I, you got me, yeah. That's what he does. Oh no, 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 Black when it comes to colors black and hat because I already know you know what I'm saying no bro no bro because black is Pittsburgh he's a Pittsburgh still yeah, a Pittsburgh fan, and so. a Celtic fan so he trying yeah, to get yeah, those yeah. colors but if it's yeah. muddy green or neon green oh I'm, I'm hitting Q first <laughs> I already got I already got a list of 2025 you got a green hat green shirt right now I, I, I have a funny story for you because E E is always the person that asks me because like he's asking me for the blacks or black well, black cement reimagined fours that are coming out next week. I really locked in my pair, which is great. Touch with like thank goodness I got that. And I was like, Yo E, I got you now. Let me just swap swap around and get swap your swap your size to so get your size. It's fine. I'll, I'll try and track it. But yeah, but like E's 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 like the first person that comes to me to ask me, Oh, can you can you help me out? But he knows me. If I need if I need my sneaker, I'll get it first, and I'll also try and get it for him. Yeah. Like, Lucky enough, I'm able to reserve my sneaker a week out so I can maneuver for him, which is fine. Gotcha. But he, it was a funny story. A funny story this week, right? I went out for his bro, right? Solo. So shout out to the bro. Um, he wanted the Jordan One Low Dra- Year of the Dragons, the green variation one, right? Yeah. With the red with a burgundy swoosh. So I went out. And I, and, I, and I was like, he told me a couple of days before, I checked the reservations um, in terms of where, where I can source this pair. I saw, I saw a pair that it was in his size, went to the store. It was a last pair. It was a display pair 
Mm. On in that in the in the in the display unit, they took mm. it out, and gave it to me, and uh, accidentally they gave me a size nine, and they did, and then they said no no I, I, I think the size nine and a half is there, and they picked it up, walk out of the store, post it on social, post it to him and post it on socials, he's like, can you get me a pair too please? I was like, oh. <laughs> all right, cool. let me double back, you let me double back and go and get him his pair because I ended up driving half an hour away from there to go to central because i had a couple of things to do in central like central london so i was there and he's messaged me he's called me he's like how does those jordan one lows look eh, they're dope can you get me a pair oh, what size do you want 8.5 i don't think they got 8.5 it could do a nine as well and i was like oh damn I, they they have a nine in the store so i have to double back and go back and get his pair but mm. you do you do that for if you do that for the bros because they they love they love it so much that you want to you know mm-hmm. kind of get it for them right uh-uh, but, uh-uh, uh-uh. but he's the first person this, that always gets thing. There's this thing called All My Friends Have Cars. There's no. also this thing called All My Friends <laughs> Have the Internet. Okay. There's, there's this there's thing called thing. Oh My Oh Gone. There's a third thing called All My Friends Have Debit Cards and Credit Cards. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I, I can send you a link or I can send you the location. Either or. The, thing, the, thing, yep. the only thing the thing yep. about E, the thing about E is he live in Africa. So, yeah, he, he, he's, he's, oh, he's got he got, he got his visa, passport, tickets, book, booking <laughs> reservation for a hotel. Yo, add it up, add yeah. it up, add it up. <laughs> but, that's a tough pill to follow with none of that. And that's but that's my, if it's still but there. My friend group, but my friend group, they all live here. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, so no excuses. What? So, no excuses. So guess what? If I if your size was there and I'm already gone, oh, I can see you the location. I can see. I can give you a phone number. Tell them just call the store. Tell them to hold that size. Or if it's online, I would gladly see you a link. You can ask my friend ninety nine. Oh, oh yeah, just happen sure. to be here. Yeah. <laughs> Ain't no lie. See, hey, bro, I, I struck out. Then he's in the link. Like, oh shit, here we go. <laughs> Bro, I, I take when I take L's on raffles, because the way raffles is different. If I hit on the yeah. raffle, then yeah, it's a pickup. But if yeah. I t- if I'm taking L's on pickup raffles, mm-hmm. links links start popping. Oh boy, I'm sending them links quick. No, oh, yeah. I'd rather naming, I'd rather you copy, you know what I'm saying? Exactly. Not naming not naming no names. Not naming no names. What's one request somebody said to you that's really like Oh hell no! I'm, no 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 no! You do it yourself. SB foes. Oh. What happened? You know that? who I'm talking. Ninety nine know who I'm talking about. Please don't vote. Please don't vote, bro. He who yeah, yeah, I know you talking about. <laughs> I know you talking about. What was I didn't already told. No, no. I didn't already told stories about him. Yeah. All right, okay, cool. <laughs> the same dude, the same dude that I had to uh convince that his Michigan four PEs weren't real. Oh, okay, cool. Okay. Yeah. I got you, I got you, I got you. <laughs> <laughs> ah, crazy, crazy. Like, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Paper, Michigan. I, I don't I don't mind helping people as long as it's I'm in the area to help somebody. See what I'm saying? What's wrong, bro? <laughs> oh man, I can't wait to get to the Super Bowl party. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> all right, cool. Should we do what we're always here to do, bro? Always, always, yes. always here to do. Right, yes, let's, do let's go. When resale is too high. Damn, resellers. Hold on, hold on. When hype beats go too far. These damn hype beats. Order, order in the court. Order. In the back door opens guilty it's time for order in the court the sneaker court of public opinion (laughs) 
Guilty! Welcome back to Sneaker Court Public Opinion with me, Judge Public Opinion and Executioner. What is up today? I don't think 99's got a court case, but I have a court case for you guys. And unfortunately, somebody in the community reached out to me and he wants to put Q in court today. <laughs> <laughs> So, allegations have been thrown from from one of the from one of the community to say we should rename this podcast to the Nike Dog Podcast because Q doesn't pick up shoe sneakers; he picks up Nikes. He's he's a Nike dog mm. and not a shoe dog. And those are the allegations that have been thrown to Q this week. All I got to say, Q, is what's your rebuttal? Mm. <laughs> Mm. First of all, <laughs> Ooh. I've been waiting for this all week. I've been waiting Ooh. for this all week. And I'm the gonna, audacity, I, I... <laughs> the unmitigated I'll... gall to challenge me on my platform. Who? Who is this person? I I will not name names, but I'll give you the person's name after the podcast, bro. <laughs> I was scared to like another brand on here. <laughs> You, I kept that to you, myself. Don't you co-sign this fool? I'm just saying though, I, I I never told nothing outside of Nike with you. You know what I mean? Ah, oh, oh, the truth, the truth is coming. No, but basically, basically, the this, allegations to me. No, from, no, I, no, no. Don't believe him. <laughs> don't believe him. Because ask him what he always got on. What he always got on? He, 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 I think I think the conversation Jordan. was every time I think the you convers- see ninety no no every time you see no no you know you you not gonna throw no allegations oh, no. at me and then not let me not let me get my shit off. No, it's over. Go, no. go 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 bro. This man I ain't never seen this man not wearing Jordans. Or Nike um, in general. I don't even see you wearing too many Nikes like that. You, well, yeah, trainers, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I know your your trainer collection is extensive. So yes, you can't talk because we the same person. I don't want to hurt your feelings. Every time, I don't Every want to hurt time. your feelings, man. You can't, hurt bro. We not here to do this. I'm you here might, to, how you go? How you? You, might, you my partner. You, you might suspect. You on, you might suspend my account, man. Shit, no, I, I brought you. I brought you on here. <laughs> to to shine light on you as a sneakerhead and bring some, bring some credibility to your collection, huh? That's I what respect I can't, that. I can't. We can't get your story. And then I I'm respect that. Attack. You my people. You supposed to be on my side. Hey man. <laughs> You, you know, know how to get down. Not, 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 you know what? The classic is 99 said he's scared to talk about other brands around you. <laughs> <laughs> now, now I'm really sweating. Now I'm really sweating. <laughs> I'm finally sweating. Want. I can't and, believe and this treachery. Your Q, guilty or not guilty? No, no. I ain't even going to do that. <laughs> but, but I'm going to give you this right here. I'm going to give you this red card. You sit this one out, okay? You take that, or you, you put that in your back pocket, and you sit this one out, all right? While I while I handle while I while I handle this uh this cool this 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 man. The podcast was named after Phil Knight's memoir. <laughs> I did remind him. I did remind him. Uh, he, he he says everybody in the Adidas size calls them uh, calls them Adidas heads, and we should be calling ourselves Nike heads. But the realis- no. realistic term is the realistic term is it doesn't matter the brand, doesn't matter where it's from. I'm I'm sticking up for you. It doesn't matter the brand where where it comes from, as long as you like leather and rubber that goes in your feet, you're a sneakerhead. That's how I put it. Basically, no, bro, no, no, no. Damn all that. I think I know who it is. And I ain't gonna say no name. I ain't gonna say no name. But I think I know who it is, okay? And I'm gonna tell you right now. I don't care about Adidas, okay? I really don't. I don't care if you care. You can care all you want. I don't care. I don't care about New Balance. I don't care about... I don't care about Reebok like that. I got a little soft spot for Reebok. A little soft spot, I do. I got a little soft spot for Aces too, because I like Jill Lights, uh, Fours and Fives. I do. But don't nobody care about no Adidas, man. You see, you Team Bjorn over there. That's what your problem is. You Team Bjorn. You're guilty of being Team Bjorn. And you try to bring me smoke on my own platform. 
Yeah. And you and you challenged the name of the platform that was based on a piece of a, a piece of art that inspired what we have here today, known as the Shoot Dog Podcast. Okay, yeah. you know what? Put your request in, brother. You put your request in to be a guest on the podcast. And we can have this conversation live for all the people to hear, okay? Because we ain't gonna tolerate no slander. You know what I'm saying? Uh, on on the you have it. name. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. Tika, this is the podcast that Mike and Tika <laughs> and Phil Knight built. All right. We are we are Knight. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. That's for you. You team Bjorn. <laughs> And we team shoe dogs over here, cause y'all don't even make sneakers over there. I don't know what y'all 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 like to make sandals and clogs and and uh, swim shoes with space boots. Huh? All right, uh, all, all, all like. I'm gonna say, all I'm gonna say is you heard the response. Cues yeah, Nike Uno reverse this to you and giving you four on top. If you wanna come on and have the discussion, come on, bro. <laughs> Let's have that discussion. Yeah, but yes, yeah, um, Cues pleads not guilty. He's a sneakerhead for Ain't no through. plea. Uh, <laughs> mm. <laughs> no plea. <laughs> no nah, plea on this one. Cup, so I ain't on that, no plea. I'm a Nike whore, <laughs> and you gonna love it. <laughs> Inconclusive. <laughs> <laughs> Hung jury. <laughs> Hung jury. <laughs> and and oh, just to round this off, like what you like, rock what you like, wear what you like. Doesn't matter about the brand or the hype. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> there you go. When we sell is too high. Damn, we sell it. Order, order. When hype beats go too far. The damn hype beats. Order, order in the court, order. In the back door opens. Guilty. It's time for order in the court. The sneaker court of public Guilty. opinion. All I'm gonna say is that went exactly the way I thought it was gonna go. <laughs> <laughs> That was magical. That was absolutely magical. That was horrible. That was the worst sneaker court ever. One sneaker brand to not appreciate the other brands. I think that's what the whole perspective is. I, I you, you, bro, the, the, the bro said he loves the podcast, by the way. So he was just taking the piece. No, he so don't. He, I just had to bring that. No, he don't. He don't love us. He can't love us. You, you can't. I don't feel love I'm it not feeling the love. <laughs> Q okay. needs a hug. <laughs> give, him, give him a virtual, give him a virtual hug on, on Instagram. He'll be happy if you did that to him. <laughs> anyway, pause. <laughs> That's the first time you said. It. You know what? You said you was gonna pause more often than you did, bro. <laughs> hey, we had uh, we had every topic like that, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was it, did, it, it did, was good. It was good. We yeah. can't force it. We don't force it. That's the thing. When we play, nah, we nah, play nah, the pause nah. game, it be all legit, bro. There's no fakeness here. There's, it's all it's all genuine. What we what you see is what you get. What we don't we do one take, and whatever you hear is what we say first take. That's it. Yeah, yeah and we pause it when <laughs> uh, when TJ headphones go out. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And that too. <laughs> or 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 when my microphone goes out. <laughs> 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 or, or if my camera glitches or if there's anything else but yo that's that's the trials and tribulations of doing the podcast uh guys yeah, yeah. like we don't we we don't like to edit the podcast even though we we clip it we don't like to edit the podcast because we want it to be genuine and 100 percent from straight from the mouth to the, ho- to the horse's ears Pause. that's what i'm saying <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. You. <laughs> Straight from the mouth. <laughs> Pause. There you go. <laughs> All right. Oh. <laughs> Episode 104. Yeah, man. E, um, uh. um, I mean, 99. Anything you want to say before we call the podcast? I mean, I love what you guys are doing. Uh, your information is to the T for people who don't know about certain shoes and what happens to a certain shoe if you don't take care of it or if you use this type of spray on this type of material, what could happen, so on and so on. Like, 
y'all are different than a lot of other podcasts. And I respect that. Even though Q, my man and all, Pauls, it's, it's refreshing to have this type of dialogue for the people that don't know. Yeah. yeah. That's what we're doing for, bro. And that's why we like to, I mean, that's why I want to have you on. Because, you know, the conversations we have <laughs> about sneakers in general, you know, it just need to be shared. Like, yeah. everybody got yeah. different perspectives. Everybody got different styles and like different things. So we like yep. to bring people on to share their perspective so that other people out there that might, you know, have things in common with you that they might disagree with us on. Yeah, facts. Mm-hmm. Can, uh, <laughs> you know, yeah. have somebody wait, wait, to wait, share wait. with. Yeah, yeah, we always, we always, we always love a conversation. The conversations are never a challenge. It's, it's, it's a discussion, and it's always good to discuss what we love. And uh, one thing I definitely want to say about the podcast is I got a hundred and hundred plus episodes in, even though it seems like a lot of work. This is fun, bro. Like I, I've like I can definitely say like this is not this is not work to me. This is absolute fun and enjoyment. The work, I the work enjoy happens. Recording. The work happens before. It's like with with you, bro. I'm pretty sure you you can agree. Uh, being an athlete, the work is practice. Mm-hmm. The games, we play the we play the games for free. You know that I hear yeah. athletes yeah. say that all the time. They pay me for practice. I play the game for free. And that's exactly. what it is. When we hit yeah, that record yeah. button, it's all about trying to have the most fun we can in a couple of hours. Yeah. Before we hit the button, it's all the planning and the this and the, that is this right. Yeah. The volume and the, ah, oh, I got to make another overlay. All right, got to yeah. make the, the, the thumbnail. Like, that's all the work stuff. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah. you got to clip it. You got to post it. You got all of that. Yeah. Even, yeah. Before, even before this episode kicked off, Q was like, oh, damn, I'm not posting my reel for today. Yo, that's <laughs> right. work. That's work. This is fun. This, that's what this is fun. See what I'm saying? Yeah. But yeah, it, it's if we didn't enjoy this, we wouldn't do this. That, that's I, I'm always gonna say say, say to that uh, mentality. But yeah, one or four episode one or four, bro. Call it, call it. Thank you, bro. Thank you, United, for coming on. I appreciate y'all for having me. Yeah, yeah, man. Always. This is about my, my partner, partner. Like I said, we yeah. gonna kick it today. And I'm gonna say oh, yeah, tomorrow. Gonna probably day after that too. I see yeah, you yeah. a lot of days. Be, 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 before we go, who's gonna win the Super Bowl? Because we're recording on Sunday. Super Bowl. Ain't oh yeah, off it's yet. coming out. It's coming, it's, out, com- it's, com- um, it's coming out Tuesday, Tuesday. so I want, I want to see how correct your predictions are. I don't know who's in the final. I'm just going to watch it from a casual it's point of view. Uh, but who, who, go on. I Kansas got the 49ers winning. Francisco. It's Kansas City and San Francisco. You taking San Francisco? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm taking San Fran. I don't know enough about the teams. Uh, you know, I don't follow American football like that. I'm a basketball dude. But so I you say San Francisco say, did it? No. I'm gonna say <laughs> Kansas City because they don't have Taylor Swift? anybody. No, they ain't got nobody on their team named Shanahan. So that's all I can right. That sounds like some hate. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it is. One hundred percent. Yeah, I think all the top so, of fans are saying that. <laughs> yeah, because that's what we're supposed to say. So I'm yeah, going for Kansas yeah. City. I don't care about yeah, Mahomes or, or Kelsey or Taylor yeah, or know. none of them. I just don't want Shanahan to win. Period. I feel you. I mean, What's I like Debo Smith. I mean, uh, uh, Samuel's rather Debo Smith. I like Debo, Debo Samuel. Smith. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I don't care. I don't care nothing about it. whatever team he on. Unless yeah. it's my team, I'm against him. I figured. And that's my OG team too. So I should, yeah. I really should be with him, but I can't. Gotcha. Sorry. Gotcha. <laughs> All right, cool. All right, cool. man. All right, and it- Anyway, episode 104 of the Shoe Dog Podcast with, a- with me and the bro and 99. Thank you for coming on, bro. Like, bro, call it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I hope everybody have a great day, great week, great month, great year in sneakers and everything else that you got going on. Please yes, make sir. sure you buy what you like and rock what you like. And don't believe the hype because the hype ain't real. Also, sneakers don't make you cool. You make the sneakers cool. Remember that, guys. Hey, you talking about? Episode episode 104, man. We'll see y'all next week. All right. Peace out, guys. Peace. Peace.